He hello? <coughs> oh, hey. What up, Pangolin? It's me. Uh, yeah, it's me. Just the streaming guy. You know, that guy that does the... Uh, he goes on Twitch. He plays video games sometimes. Usually most of the times. Um, and does other things, too. Other really funny and cool things. You know? I'm that guy. Uh, let me know if you hear this. Because this time... I shouldn't be playing. I'm not playing Limp Bizkit, right? Especially right, I'm not playing anything right now. now. I know you hear this, but let me know if you hear something in just a moment. You'll know what I mean. Uh, and I, uh, you know, I'm not uh, playing Limp Bizkit only to my VOD. I swear. I don't kill dogs. It's not even a dog. First of all, that was a beast, and he just fell off. It wasn't my fault. Just like Jeb forgetting how to breathe and all that stuff. But uh, still. Do you hear? Man, my, my microphone seems so sensitive. I turned it all the way down. It's not as sensitive. Hold on. I got to find that right medium. You hear music. Okay, good. Good. Because that's good. That means... Limpus, it means Fred Durst is not going directly to my VOD. Mm -mm -mm. I was thinking about playing Kingdom Come today. Come Kingdom Delivery. What do you guys think? <clears throat> Could be cool. This ain't Fred Durst, dog. <laughs> Yeah, I know it's loud. And I, t I even turned myself down, apart from it being loud, too. He better not come to my house, goddammit. Unfortunately, it won't bounce you, so I'll have to do it. Who is Borks? My evil twin brother. We must beware this man. You know what? Chicken nuggets. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'll return with the wind the day. A dumb red comes to ass a bay. Bloom, blue, do, do. Hark, frosty hoot. Come. Delivery. I've been in a bit of a... Uh, I've been tr <laughs> trying to stay as uh, far away from the Mord house. <laughs> trying try to stay away from Mord house. But I've been... Uh, I think I'm going to go get some mead tomorrow, chat. <laughs> what do you think of that? Now, let me see. I should be able to look at some of my VOD now. I want to double check to make sure that you can only hear me, which is how it should be, of course. Crows. It is Crow Day! Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. 
Nice. You can't hear this on my VOD. How cool is that? You probably hear it a little bit from my headphones, though. So, hey, VOD watchers, heck off. Sometimes we just got to get a little medieval in this bitch and not have it recorded necessarily. I can play any song I want <laughs> in, in sort of kind, not really, but I could play Durst. I can't play. I, I can't go that hard that fast, dog. How does that work? Um, you can, you can separate the audio tracks. So I've got one for live streaming and then one for what? Well, one for live streaming and VOD and then one just for VOD. And right now, the one just for VOD right now is just my voice. And it would also be uh, the game audio and stuff. And I can easily make it, uh, I can bring back the, uh, you know, the regular music. I won't do this all the time. Because I'm sure, I mean, I've, I've watched some VODs with this on. And it is, it's weird seeing chat jam out to a song. And then, uh, <laughs> and then, um, you know, <laughs> there's nothing but silence. And like just a streamer sitting there going, bah, bah, bah. Yeah, but I'm I'm in I'm in kind of a I'm getting, I'm in kind of a I'm in a bit of a power metal mood in a way. I was more like Viking metal. That's a very good band, by the way. I don't know if anybody likes kind of like Viking metal and black metal. They do both of that. Bathory, very good band. I only recently discovered them, and they're actually kind of they're kind of pioneers in what they do. Uh, very good. Uh, they were anyway. So, yeah. DMCA trucking stream. We could. Yes, Smurf talk. <laughs> this is my favorite song. Smurf talk. I don't kill dogs, dog. One of the hard parts is, though, I, I do not know how loud this is on stream. I'm just going by the levels. I keep changing it. I keep bringing it lower when I want to talk, and then I bring it higher when I don't. When I want to jam. But Nobody ever, nobody ever does quote 41, dog. His body was tiny. His heart was big. Louder. Oh my God. I can, pl I can play any song. I can play any song. This is going to be, this is such a cathartic intro to the stream, dog. I can do anything. I'm so powerful. I've wanted to share so much music. We might have to do an American Truck Simulator uh, stream again soon. Because this is good. There's a lot of, there's a lot of music that I found that I'm like, hey, you guys know about these guys? Because they're pretty good. There's so much stuff. Unless they are listening live. Uh, the Dimka people? Yeah, that's the problem. You're still not, not, not supposed to do this, but here we are. <laughs> you know? Uh, do what exactly? Oh, I don't know. I ain't doing anything. There's no Dimka here, dog. Don't worry about it. There actually is no music playing right now, though. Uh, I'm just very, very, uh, I, I got all this presence, dog. 
But now I don't know what to play. There's so much music. You want to see your faces? Fine. They don't bounce, though, with this right now. But here you go. You can build them up. I can bounce them with my voice. You probably can't hear me. <laughs> well, which so many died. Blood and glory. You can totally hear it in my microphone, though. That's not going to be good. One dime. I would take the Northwest Passage to find the land of Franklin reaching for the Bravo Sea. Passage to the sea. Hey, what up, everybody? Twitch Sings is back. I love this song. She, this is probably one of my favorite. This is probably my, my favorite modern uh, metal band. Unleash the Archers. Very powerful. And obviously, this isn't their song. It's a cover, but... Um, it's very good. Box 94. Bounce, Smurf Dark. Yes, build the blocks. No, this is a song from 1981. <laughs> it's by a guy named Stan Rogers. It's a it's a classic Canadian song. J Debs knows it. But this is a cover. Hell, hold on. Let's we can do this. Let's listen. Uh, let's listen to the original from '81. It's good too, if I remember correctly. Skirt. Land so white and savage. Very sea shanty. Very good. God bless Canada. I used to know the Canadian National Anthem because I watched so much hockey. I don't know if I still do. The Borkst of Times. A no dim stream. Can you believe it? No dimka.
I love music. Don't dim kill me. There's nothing going on. Don't call me tardy. Straight childhood. 81, baby. What up, everybody? How you doing, Bill? How you doing, Neil? How you doing, Neon? How you doing, Jadebs? How you doing, Frosty Hoot? I'm not tardy. I am very much on time. Jadebs, no. You know, Nightbot is ruthless. It's all good, homie. Canadian vignette. Log driver's waltz. Seems very Canadian. No, uh, Jeb, no. Games to play on your phone? They should release Hades on mobile, Smurf Doc, TBH. Enough of that. Now it's time to go even further beyond. Smurf Doc, you're going to be away all weekend. I got to hit you with the hottest disc track of 2019, son. Yeah, what is it? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. You know how it'd be out here on these streets. Ayo, hey, Smurf Doc. Let me tell you how it'll be. Hey, Smurf, get off my turf, because you is going to go down. Yeah. I'm not a clown. I got a gun, and to shoot it, it gives me fun. Yeah, so you better watch out, because I'm looking for that clout, because I got murder on the mind, and I got some brine, because I make my own pickles. Bitch, I ain't a snitch. I go down for the crew, and then in prison I take a big poo on anyone that steps up to me. Yeah, cause I'm hard in multiple ways. Check it out. You got this exclusive content. Oh my God, this is gonna sound so weird on the VOD. Anyway, clowns and guns go together really well and also there's something else to say yeah i'm gonna play come kingdom delivery bitch uh yeah you're gonna miss out on medieval times witch burn her with these fire bars like my name is lars straight out of sweden you know that i'm trying to feed in my wife and kids and put stuff on the table and i got a ladle and i'm gonna use it to drink fruit punch i packed a lunch let's see what's inside oh shit it's a beretta blah 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 now you're dead because i shot you with my gun yeah yep i did it it's done also I'm really famous because I got a really big gamus library on Steam. And I got a laser beam. It's in the sky. I don't lie. I like my bread rye and dry, not wet and moist, because then it induces mold and mildew, and that's not choice. Blap, 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 blap. That's the noise I make when I fart. Put you in a shopping cart. Take you to the front of the store and check you out. Girl, I'm, I'm checking you out, biatch. Oh, yeah. 
Remix. Was that good? Did you like that? That was a, that was a rap for you, Smurf Doc. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, that was called um, Smurf Doc gets put in a shopping cart and driven around the store like a like a little kid. Um, by Box Ninety Four. I hope you enjoyed it. Cringe. Oh God, no, <laughs> oh no. It's, it's, I assume it doesn't show up in the clips. Oh no. <laughs> Oh no. Listen, there was a listen, there was there was a beat, I swear. I do make I make my I No, I'm not. I do. This is true. <laughs> All right, let's stop. I don't want to listen to it anymore. It's not good, dog. I mean, I mean, I that's look, it's hot fire, but you know, you need you really need to you really need to know like like look, you know, I like I I like to consider myself, you know, Eminem, Rabbit, right? You know, uh, at the end of 8 Mile when when the music shuts off, but he doesn't need it anyway to to finish to finish absolutely icing his the fool across from him, you know what I mean? Uh, that, that's that's kind of me. I'm a, I'm kind of a freestyle god, really. Uh, I'm not I'm not cr look just because I'm a cringe like it's like how I'm the weeb god. I'm a cringe lord, right? I'm the lo I, I I I see over the the subjects. I'm not necessarily one of them. Okay, that'd be cringe. I'm not cringe, but I am the cringe lord. Like that, that's fine. Uh, but still, Deem, are you rapping on fools? Okay, very nice. Oh my gosh. You know what I realized? I can also listen uh right now to uh I am the look <laughs> I am the cringe lord, but I'm not cringe. It's not hard, homie. You have to understand me. You, you just got to understand. Do you guys remember what game I played? <laughs> what tell what's up? All right, chat. God damn it, trigger happy. <laughs> What game did I play this song in, chat? <laughs> what, what what high octane game did I play this song for? <laughs> God damn it, trigger happy. Fine. It's not hard. Have you talked to a doctor about that? Shut up, Jim. For the ultimate holes in one, the Weeb God never backs down. I love this song. I am the god of weebs. And the lord of cringe. Fear me, mortals. For I... Yes. 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 You need to listen to more Brute. Carpenter Brute is by far my favorite electronic artist. In fact, not only not only do I believe that his album Trilogy is the greatest electronic album ever made, but I think it is, in all genres, 
if you consider the level of music, like the quality of the music in the genre that albums are made for, I think this is one of the greatest albums of all time. I th every single song is is just so good. Every song on this album is amazing. It's crazy. I get, and that's that's what I would rate to be a a, a quality uh, album, right? You can have an album with with some bangers on it, sure, but every song. I mean, I mean, look at this shit. Like, look at this. What's the least popular song on this album, except for like the? Uh, there's not even there's not even like an intro or an outro. It's just all music. I don't know. Like, just, just picking one out. Like, you guys ever heard three hundred and forty seven Midnight Demons? Which is a sick address, by the way. Like, you ever heard this song? From his album, dog? Yeah, Wake Up the President is, is fantastic. What's up, Siffy? Siffy Bounce! Have I listened to Crystal Castles? No. Come back over here. Box 94. Skirt. I don't know. What is Crystal Castles? Are they like this? What I think of Leather Teeth? I think it's good. I like Trilogy better. I think Leather Teeth is solid. If you can even hear me. I think Leather, Leather Teeth is more like one of those albums where I like some songs better than other. I think I can't remember. I can't remember. I got to listen to it all in, in uh, one go again. Perturbator. I do like Perturbator. I heard Perturbator long before I heard uh, Carpenter Brute. No, nah, I finna make it rain on you, bitches. Hold up. Open wide for my nugget fountain. Bow. Bow, bow. I mean, this is just like this is just like a throwaway song on any album, right? It's in between, uh, like uh, Roller Mobster is two songs after this. Uh, Le Perve is after this, which I think is more popular. And like later on is when you have like seven songs later is like Turbo Killer and Paradise Warfare and Hang 'Em All. Looking for Tracy Zoo is really good. On I love Roller Mobster too, honestly. Like. It's not one of my favorite songs. Like, I love it. Because, like I said, I love every song on this. I have a several above that one, in my opinion, including this one. I love this song. I love the... It's going to sound so weird without the audio in the vibe. Yes! Friday night, baby! I feel like partying, yeah? Best VOD ever. It's a it's Friday night. I feel like letting my uh my ponytail down, you know what I'm saying? Ba -do -ba -do. And celebrating those of you that come lively. You got a beer? You know what I got in my fridge? Uh one of my friends brought it over several weeks ago. And I still have some left. I got some... Uh, you ever had Twisted Teas, chat? They're basically like alcoholic sweet teas. Uh, they don't taste that sweet either. They're pretty good. 
I got some of those. I might need to crack open a twisty tea, yo. Ponytail and a beard. I used to have a ponytail. I told you, though, I, I donated it to, for the kids, Smurf Doc. Yeah, I'm kind of a big deal. We already heard this one. T? What do you mean, T Dan's game? Ponytail? What about this, Giggin? Sometimes I put it up in a man bun. Yeah, what are you going to do about it, Giggin? Huh? Call me cringe. But guess what? This absolute tall, super muscular cringe lord going to come out, and they finna smack... You down, dog. If you're a sucker for man buns, well, there you go. Sometimes, look, as long as it's tied back, you donated your ponytail when you were younger, well, there you go. We're basically the same person. I'm not I'm not cringe. I am the cringe lord, but I'm not cringe. Mm-mm-mm. No man. We're basically twins. Also, another really good song. Uh, yeah, I like this one, too. Demi mentioned it. Wake up the president. Just a good, very stylized. Oh, man. I listened to this entire album multiple times, but most recently, driving. It's only an hour and a half on a very long drive. And it was an experience. I don't think I thought anything else other than of the music the entire time. It was just like I fast traveled listening to the music for an hour and a half. I don't even remember the drive. You know what I mean? Yes, bitch crushed them all. No, I've not heard of Lorne. Coco, whooshy. We're doing a Dimka stream because the VOD. Well, no, we're not. We're not. We're not playing any Dimka music, FYI, for anyone listening out there. But the VOD can't hear anything that we can hear. You're getting an exclusive look. Post these bands in the Discord, tell us, Zach. You know where to put them, dog. We're all pretending that we're hearing things right now. VOD94. But we can go even further beyond. All right, what's this? We can go even further beyond for our Dimka stream. Yeah. What? I'm so damn good. <laughs> okay. Yeah. There's a chungus among us. There's a chungus among us. Enough. No. No more, Mr. Nice Guy. You can see chat from me. <laughs> you can't watch video, but you can see chat. She knows. Eddie knows that there's a rack attack going on. Eddie can't even listen to the Dimka music. She might get Dimka IRL. You never know, dog. I don't know what the song is, but it sounds like a banger. What's up, everybody? Thank you so much for coming out. My name is My Daddy Boy, and you're here to watch our mathy miss one. <laughs> no. Poor Amathy. Very powerful, other than the one break. Where was it? Was it like towards the end, Amathy? Is that when you're messing up towards the end or towards the beginning? I know Mango Bay. It's a pretty damn good song. Homie. 
Eddie, I say hi to you. I don't know if she can hear me, though. Hi, Eddie Lee Wee. Bam, 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 bam. Don't call her. Don't call her what? What? Are you trying to dim me in the chat? I need to be louder so she can hear me. Don't make me tur turn my mic sensitivity all the way up. What, Siffy? Play and video game? What do you mean, dog? What do you think I'm doing right now? Siffy's ears are so refined that he can hear the music even in the VOD. It's the only way. I didn't forget. Box thinks we forgot. No. Box lied. Tiny base died. No. Madge. Do not be mad. One v one you and DJ Max. Uh, eight buttons only. Just dance strum for Dimka. <laughs> what up? Nineteen hours. I'm not. I'm, I didn't do anything to Tiny Beast. Two hentai games. DJ Max ain't hentai. Well, maybe a little bit. Maybe some of it, but not not the bits I've watched. You'll donate fifty dollars if I can even clear an eight button song. Can I download a custom song? I want to play Baby Shark. It's all good. Nineteen hours. I see him. Three hentai games. Eddie, you're watching stream. Eat the nuggets. Baby. Bobby. Shark. I may be a cringe lord, but Siffy is the prime minister of cringe. It is McBuffer. Put me on 160p. Put me on 160p, Eddie. 160p only. For audio only. I'll be your podcast. Fool. If only I wasn't a trans codelet. What? I'm not a trans codelet. I know damn well I'm not. I can see that. You need to grind some songs. One day left to double XP. Well, when's the new season? Start. You can make that up easy. Foolish Siffy. He thinks he can sniff out games. I will not remove the nuggets. They can be any nugget you wish. They're magical, you know. I actually had I had some uh, some something interesting today. I had some plant based spicy chicken nuggets. No chicken. And I would not have been able to tell that they weren't chicken. They were also very spicy. They were very good. I would not have known. Plant-based? Based on what? Based on the hardware that's inside. Jeb. What was the name of the nugget? <laughs> I can't tell you that. Actually, hold on. Let me see if I can tell you that. Hold on. Spice masks shit flavor? No. Spice masks rotten food. <laughs> oh, now? Okay, now we're jamming. Oh, now we're Dimka jamming, boys. Hold on. Let me see if I can tell you. Ooh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Am I a spicy boy or pasty? No spice. Um, it, the, the brand is called Raised and Rooted Nugget. 
It was pretty good. It was on sale, so I bought it. I was like, I'll give it a shot. What's the worst that could happen? I am, uh, you probably can't hear me very well, Alon. I am not a, um, I'm not a big spice guy, all right? I've, like, lately I've been kind of, I've been kind of hungry for spice. I don't know what it is. I should, I should probably get some curry, and that would be pretty good. Um, yeah, I'm not a big spice guy. Oh, shit. My tweet! No! I closed out before I sent it. No! Do I still have the picture? Okay. Lowercase p. Spicelet. Your taste buds are too short to appreciate spice. What do you mean short taste buds? Yo, I'm about to put that TTS up to 10 ki uh 10 biddies. What have you turned into? The ultimate non-Dimka stream, Kadnar. That's right. Absolutely no music is playing right now. Absolutely no music, no matter what you think you hear. No music is playing. Don't worry about it, dog. Grade 94. I have decided to never play music or game audio. Well, no, there will be game audio. But no music ever again. Zero. I didn't, I didn't actually realize that game had multiplayer, Amathy. You're Pepe laughing at casuals. I'm very legit. Yeah. Uh, that plant-based nugget was really good. Better than chicken McNuggets. That's Let me tell you something about McDonald's, all right? Listen. I have I may have worn a Twitch jacket to McDonald's and they're like, "Hey, you should you should you should contact someone and have them sponsor your stream. And I was like, yeah, okay, hello, well. But you know what? Their McNuggets are disgusting. By far the worst fast food nugget. You know what? Fuck McDonald's. McDonald's has good coffee? Do they? Do, do they not? Do they? <laughs> In Canada? All right. What about Tim Hortons? The mocha frappe is good. The mocha frappe is good, but that's because I like coffee-flavored <laughs> desserts is what that is. I really like coffee-flavored stuff. Probably even more so than coffee, which I've become a fan of anyway. You bought a coffee from McDonald's and you were given hot milk with no coffee? <laughs> Are you sure? That cuz that that is kind of what their lattes taste like, prostitute. Or rather their um like their cappuccino. All basically that is what they taste like. You're not wrong though, actually. But I will drink a big cup of milk as well. Oh shit. This is a hell of a imaginary playlist that we're listening to right now. And it's, this just this this kind of makes me sad to listen to though, because it reminds me of Twitch sings. Which I wish I wasn't banned from when it started. <laughs> you guys remember the multiplayer would never work for me. Yeah, it's John. Well, yeah, we're thinking about Johnny Cash really hard right now. I'm glad you guys can read. I'm glad you guys got the Neuralink gloves and you can read my brain waves. Also, screw you, Smurf Doc. When the man comes around. Lockhart, no. It's, it's what he just said. In your mind. 
Have I ever gone to Nashville? No. I would go. That's right. Play Cash's original? Ah, yes. What about Nine Inch Nails' cover of Hurt, though? What about that? You like you like their cover? <laughs> Was this in Better Call Saul? I don't know. I never watched that. I never watched Breaking Bad, chat. You know this. What about Depeche Mode's cover of Personal Jesus? Yeah, it didn't really have the edge that uh, Marilyn Manson brought, you know? Uh, and in his original score of uh, Marilyn, or... Uh, personal jesus but i like that danzig cover 13 yeah dog or stan rogers cover of unleash the archers northwest passage it's kind of crazy that he he copied it and then used a time machine to go back to 1981 though to make it that's kind of weird Do I mean the Nine Inch Nails so song that Cash covered? No, 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 no. We're talking about Hurt Cadenar. We're talking about the one that, that Johnny Cash wrote and then Nine Inch Nails covered Johnny Cash's Hurt. That one. That's the one we're talking about. You met his brother? Uh, whose brother? Stan Rogers' brother? Or, uh, no, you didn't tell me that. Or at least if you did, I didn't see it. That's neat. Boom, but da boom but it. No, Smurf Doc. That's right, Cadnar. We're talking about Johnny Cash's original hit, Hurt, that he wrote by himself and did not cover. And then Nine Inch Nails sequentially covered. And then when Nine Inch Nails said, or Johnny Cash said that their cover was so good that the, the song was, was uh, Trent Reznor's now. That song. All right, Smurf Doc, you know what to do when you land. Have a safe flight. Bon voyage. She's going all the way to Paris, chat. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? I can't believe that. That's crazy. Man, that's just the ultimate playlist. Oh, shit. Her arms are going to be tired. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. That's right, Robo friend. I, re <laughs> I remember that. What is this? Is this from something? Zip. What's that song from the Transformers anime? Gotta go fast. We've got to kill chaos, guys. He has the emeralds. It's Sanic. Man, I love imagining music. You've got the touch? Yeah, I think that is the one I'm thinking of. <laughs> this is like I don't know when when was when did this come out? This is like what this is the song 
When I think of the 80s, I think of this song. And I don't even know if this came out in the... I don't even know when this came out. Eighty six. Yeah. Optimus Prime died for our sins. I've never seen it, though. I probably should because I've heard good things about it as well. Yeah. <laughs> you got the touch. You got the power. It's time to play video games, chat. It's time. Kingdom come. Deliverance. You got the touch. I can't kill the tiny beast there, dog. Like and retweet now. You got the touch. I'm not a monster. I'm just a gamer. <laughs> but I guess to you, chat, what's the difference? Kingdom come delivery. Buffy bum bum bum. Box 94. Skirt. Hold on. I know you can't see. That's okay. It was super bright anyway. I would have blinded you. There we go. Charles IV, King oh. of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor, had a long and successful reign. I love history. He ruled from Prague expanded. Probably, we'll see if we finish this game. It's probably really long. No, Charlie. When the Emperor died, the whole empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. Is this intro new? I don't remember it from when I launched the, the game three the years ago. The flourishing empire was Charles' son, Wenceslas IV, whose father had prepared him for this moment all his life. He looks happy. <laughs> oh my lord. But Wenceslas did not take after his father. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. <laughs> he even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor, which did little to endear him to the Pope. Why wouldn't you want to go to that? Last the idol. That sounds awesome. Not impress the imperial nobility either. His difficulties mounted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. Not Hungary. Sigismund decided on a radical solution. Monker Giga. The king Jesus! The lady got axed. Then took advantage of the ensuing disorder to gain greater power for himself. He invaded Bohemia with a massive army and began pillaging the territories of the king's armies. I'm learning so much. 
It is here that my story begins. Is Optimus Prime actually Jesus? Kingdom Come. Man, look at the... Look at that. <laughs> Uh-oh. Is that what we're dealing with back here? <laughs> it's very quiet. There's no, there's no menu noises. All right. Uh, the textures? I mean, I got it. Wh what do you mean the DLC HD textures? All right, dog. <laughs> what? Excuse me? Hello? Okay. <laughs> Who stole my texture? I don't know, dog, but I'm pumping it up to as high as we go. Hold on. Maybe I can just do it. Okay. Hold on. Ultra high. It's experimental and intended for future hardware. All right. Hold on. Very high. I mean, I I don't think I'm in the future that much. Okay. <laughs> Okay, it's still the okay. It's still the same. All right, I guess we're not. <laughs> Alrighty. Very well. No textures. That's fine. Sound? Do I have sound? S sound volume. In-game menu vol music volume. Oh, all right. Uh, well, that, that that's what it wanted before. So fine. That's fine. It's got eye tracking. I don't want you to look. Seeing me looking at medieval booba, all right? Hardcore mode. Hmm. Hmm. I am pretty hardcore. But I don't know. I know I am not familiar with the essentials of combat and survival in the world of Kingdom Come Deliverance. But I'm sure we can... Oh, I don't know, chat. Why don't you decide? It's just chivalry. Chivalry is pretty realistic. Probably the most realistic medieval fighting game available, right, chat? I'm moving chat. Speaking of chat, I'm moving you guys back over to the left side. Thank you, Jeb. It really means a lot. Uh, I'm playing normal mode. Should there be music? Okay. <laughs> I was worried. The early 15th century was a time of turmoil in the Holy Roman Empire, which had flourished in the late Emperor Charles IV, but now, with the son Winkless the Idol on the Bohemian throne, was falling into disarray. The king's inactivity angered many of the nobility, as well as his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary, who decided to do something. But I couldn't read it. Chivalry or Mordhau? Mordhau? Whoa. Moose. All right, chat. I, I really don't know much about this game. I remember the intro briefly. Silver Skalitz, 1403. When do we deliver the car? Behold, come kingdom delivery. In Jurassic Park. I remember that too, Coco. That's why I stopped playing it, because it was super buggy when I played it very briefly. But I hope the RPG elements allow me to become as degenerate as possible. It has lockpicking elements, Frosty Hoot, a whole mini game. I do not remember these cutscenes. The game doesn't pause when you lockpick. Monka gigigigiga. Well, 
husband. Oh. How goes it? Hello, wife. Good. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. He was still sleeping when I went oh, out. Oh, that's right. We're a character. At this hour. Blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like. I wanted a to make my own character, Chat. His full name would have been Mordhow Veteran. Lazy bones up there. Woo! Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm-hmm. What play is Inri? We can't make our Henry. own character? No, we're Henry. Get up now. This is There's us. work to be done. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slug of egg. Hear that? Cock. Better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Banjaxed. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play Ooh. again, haven't you? You better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Blah, blah, blah. Don't worry, it wasn't that. It wasn't that. I just scratched myself is all. Hmm. Well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. <gasps> Foreshadowing that we can become a rogue? Oh. <laughs> 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 Do I get to play? I have my FPS at the top left, chat. Well, that's not good. Uh, uh, where? Oh, no. Oh, no. Where's my mute? Where's my in game sound, chat? <laughs> uh. Uh oh. Is this a bug? Have I been bugged already? I didn't play this game for three years to let it get debugged. And I bug as soon as I play it. Oh. Be right back. Bum, 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 bum. Box 94. Skirt. That's okay. I have other sound that is good. Hold on. I'm kingdom coming. <laughs> but why am I bug 94? Why? Oh my god. It flashbangs you as soon as you launch it, chat. Do I have to buy the HD? Do I have to buy the sound as well as the HD textures? Bum, 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 bum. Box 94. Skirt. Okay, I can hear sound now. Excellent. Pate Noster, qui es in seris, sanctificetur nomen tu, veniat regnum tu, fiat voluntas tua, sicut in celo et in terra. Yes. You're about to unlock mounts in FF14? Hey, everybody. Stiffy's about to unlock mounts in Final Fantasy. Oh, this is much better. I thought it was a little weird that it started out without any sound. That's all right. I'm sure we can skip. Hey, everybody. Fine state you're in this morning. Hey. What on earth did you get up to last night? Oh. By means of the first two choices in this dialogue, you will select your character's default characteristics. If you're not satisfied with them, not to worry. All characters can be further developed without limitations. Okay. Uh, I was with Bianca. Vitality. I think, um, I think speech, I think speech would be fun. I feel, I feel like that would be nice. I want to be a sly man's. We were chatting in the tavern. Mm, nothing much. 
Me and the lads were just having a chat in the tavern. We're just having a go of it. Some wayfarer stopped by. He was telling us what's going on in the world, and, um... Well, I, uh, I lost track of time. We were just chatting. Well, I hope you didn't fill your head with nonsense. Well, I've got a feeling Ooh. there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand. And that suspicious-looking character with a sword who turned up in town Yeah, I, I feel like strength, agility, vitality, those can all be, uh... I mean, we can make our, we can make our speech even more goodlier. I feel like everything else is, uh, I mean, agility might be cool. Archery. Uh, but we can be even goodlier at speech. We're gonna, let's do a luck speech build. <laughs> yes. Uh, Mord Vet, very good at speech, obviously. You think he's teaching me sword fighting, don't you? What use would that be to me? Here. I'm not lying to you, Ma. All right, then, if you say so. I don't mean to pry, Speech but build, you know baby. your father takes a dim view of such things. Dim? Wait, did I not upgrade my speech again? Go to the sword fighting lesson. Oh, I'm hungry. Can I get something to eat? I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. Oh, I'm angry. Is poor angry at me? His father angry with me for sleeping late. Literal medieval need. He's not happy. That's why. Yesterday you promised him you'd We're a more now vet if he makes sense. He's not as young as he was. And you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain. But he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, Ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. He always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. Mm -hmm. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. Have my friends been here? Did Matthew and Fritz come looking for me? No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Something this guy absolutely wouldn't do is... Uh, oh, wait, well, hold on. We're not done yet, dear. Uh, I don't want to talk about... Oh, not this again. Leave it lie, Mother. Uh, the last thing this guy would do would be to ask his mom for if he, if she needs help with anything. So, skirt. Oh, oh my God, the sensitivity though. Hold on. Oops. Beds in ninety four. I don't feel any different. One click. All right, that'll work. Still very sensitive. Man, I'm getting some pretty low frames. I mean, it's not that bad, I guess. No HD textures, by the way. Eat from the pot. Ugh, why's it gotta sound like that, dog? Drop into pot. I have nothing to drop into the pot. <laughs> Have you mentioned that this game is buggy AF? Yes, dog, I know. <laughs> yeah, I, I've experienced this. Cheese! <laughs> My cheese now. It's me. Ooh. Put a pretzel in there. Bread roll. Mine. Can I get fat? Can I pick this apple up? This can't be done while sitting. Very well. Give it to me. Mine. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Hip. How does one crouch? There we go. Stealth. If you want to sneak in somewhere, make sure no one sees or hears you. Depending whether you're seen or not depends on the light and your clothing. Whether they hear you depends on the surface you're moving on and your attire, especially your footwear. Mine. 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 Why does he get back up to pick things up? I feel like that defeats the purpose of stealth. Scoop. Scoop. I must stand to eat. The back of my hands are sticky. That doesn't surprise me, Coco. I have very good speech. And that's all. Literally nothing else is good about me. 
Carrot. I, I just, I'm just collecting all of the food. Is I is my inventory? I'm going to change that. Look at all this shit. Nice. Uh, health, energy, nourishment. I must eat more. Eat. Mmm. 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 An apple a day keeps the plague away. Mmm. Mmm. I'm 100% nourished. Oh my god. Where'd it go? What? It made, it made the apple bag disappear. Alright. You know what? Okay, never mind. <laughs> the compass will tell you where to go in your quest that you are pursuing. Just head for the active objective waypoint. Very well. Let me know if the game... I changed uh, my graphical settings a little bit for stream. My graphicals, chat. Let me know if it ever gets a little too dark again and I can uh, revert. But uh, I, feel, I felt like a game like this, I don't want it to be too washed out. I can get fat if I eat too much. Man, I really... What does tab do? I would really like tab to be my inventory. I can increase my nourishment to above 100. When can we vote to turn off the lights? I've eaten too much. I won't be hungry for a much longer time now, but you'll be clumsy until you've digested everything. All right. Very well, then. Ba -ba -ba Hi, Dad. It's me, your son. What's the matter with you, Henry? Didn't you hear me calling you? No. Sometimes you need the power of persuasion to achieve your goals. When talking to people, you can often choose what kind of impression you want to make on them. We can simply use speech, and it's influenced by the reputation you have at the moment with the person you're talking to. Okay, I feel like we've made a mistake. Uh, in the Middle Ages, social status was paramount, so the quality of your attire and how well-groomed you are, together with your reputation, can make a big difference to how people respond to you. If you look dangerous, people will be afraid to cross you and will also be more willing to assign risky tasks to you. That's influenced mainly by your strength and the deter deterrent effect of your weapons and equipment, but other things are also taken into account, such as blood stains on your clothes. Nice! So we just need to sacrifice some uh, pigs to make people scared of us and give us things. Nice rolls, Simu. You can sometimes rely on money to do the talking for you. And in special cases, you can try other skills like horsemanship. Okay. But different approaches work on different people. You want to intimidate a tough brawler easily. And no matter how well you dress, you want to impress the nobility easily. That's because Henry's abilities aren't simply assigned a universal value, but compared with the abilities of his counterpart. You can see the values of the various abilities in the game under the corresponding icons. You can always see your own abilities. Your counterpart's abilities are visible to you if it's someone you know well or if you're skilled at reading people. We can become empathetic? We, we can become the new person, the new uh, life is strange person that can read people's colors and also their minds. Wow. I will deliver, Giggin. Don't worry about it. It's not about the stouts. The incomes are influenced by other factors. Jeez Louise. Speech level, charisma level, strength level. So we need to be, we need to have a higher level than other people to be goodly very well. Uh, we don't know our father well enough to know what he's about. Uh, our, also, our speech isn't very good. What's the matter with you, Henry? Didn't you hear me calling to you? Well, our, our reputation with him apparently is good. Sorry, father. I was taking a stroll and lost track of time. Somehow I had a feeling I was seeing everything for the first time. How, my boy? When are you going to get some sense? I can't. Anyway, we have a lot of work to do today. Success. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? Join the I'm East India Trading Company, Siffy. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money, then. Ooh. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Go Not desert to mention merchants. his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. 
Kunis, that drunkard. <laughs> That'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm big. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally oh. use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. He'll come. Sure he'll be happy to hear it. Deliverance. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasso. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. Blah, blah, blah. Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. Hmm. I went to my father, and now we must deliver. Da -da 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 -da. Buy a bag of charcoal, collect the debt from Kunesh, pick up the cross guard at the castle, do something, buy ale from our GF. The order of the twin adder of Gridania. The Maelstrom of Limsum Lumsum. <laughs> I like the Order of the Twin Adder. Which one's that? Is that the Desert Merchants? If that's the Desert Merchants, that's that's doubling up on them. I'm all in on the DM. All right, I see my stamina bar down low. I also have a pig meter. <gasps> I can punch. That's the Desert Merchants? That's the one I like, dog. The Order of the Twin Adder of Gridania. I'm overfed. Damn right I am. The Desert City sucks. Man. Did I just start the game? Indeed I did. Hello. How can I help you? Ew! Twin Adder is forced? Which one's the desert one then? Can I take a horse already? No. Sorry! <laughs> He's gone. <laughs> Look, he had it coming. Where'd he go? Hopefully we won't need that guy later. Hello, mother. Is everything all right, son? Mm. Take care. <laughs> Why are you looking at my mom like that? Got a problem? Well, I think we're not getting very much. That doesn't look very clean. There's some grass. There's a, looks to be some kind of grass in there. Oh, what? All right. Cool. You discovered charcoal burner. Hello, charcoal burner. God be with you. And with you in shops, you first have to put uh, your purchases into your basket and then either confirm the price or try to haggle. Take care. I don't know how much I need to buy. Probably just one. Uh, <laughs> I will pay 0.5. My reputation, 94. Oh, wait, how much money do I have? Do I have no money? I have no money. Uh oh. That's a problem. You good? You might have to join the Limsa Lominsa. I hate that name though. Is that the is that the forest people? They're my second choice. Name looks decent. I would never guess this has an HD textured DLC. Uh, pretty good. I'm on the very high. S okay, see now back over there though. Kind of looks like it looks like the game becomes Borderlands over there at that forest. Probably hard for you guys to see. It looks <laughs> kind of cell shaded, but uh, it looks really good. I'm down. 
Oh, they're the port pirates. Oh, yeah, it's the other one. Man. What? What the? Is this the drunkman? Kunesh? God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? Money. Father sent me for money. My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Pay for the tools at least. You know you owe father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. Debts must be paid. <laughs> you can expect a visit from my father. Look, I know things aren't easy. Your wife ran off. Booze is dear these days. Mm -hmm. You're as much use as a square wheel. It's no wonder you're short of coin. I wonder if but a debt's a debt. Lower speech have different options. Something. Different, spe uh, different if speech. If I had anything to give, I'd give it. But I've got nothing. So leave me in peace, all of you. And don't come back. Wait, so it worked, but it didn't. And then I lost reputation and gained reputation. Now I have to get the hammer and nails another way. Okay. I see. I like this map. This is nice. Ooh. Steal his, steal his cock. I was trying. You can't pick him up, unfortunately. Proving that chivalry is, in fact, the better one. Hey, it's the axe, right? Christ! Sorry! A thief! People! <laughs> a thief! God! Hey, get your ass back here! <laughs> oh, bitch! <laughs> Alright, here we go. <laughs> hey. Check it out, dog. Alright, we got a hook. We got a jab. We got a kick. Tab locks on and switches. Left shift unlocks cube blocks. These are some, these are some weird. These are gonna take some getting used to after chivalry. Uh, stand, an opponent strike hits you. Your armor, you block. It'll cost stamina. We got our health. Uh, that little purple bar is the opponent bar. We got wounds. All right, fair enough. What the hell are you doing? You wanna go, bitch? Yeah, but. Hey, you. Don't move a muscle. What the fuck? Come on, Surrender. Shit. Oh, okay. Under well, for the I door. didn't do shit. Ow! God damn it. You want to go, bitch? <laughs> ah, ah, ah. I died. And so ends the story of Mordhau Vet, the wise. What the fuck? When was my last save? All right. This is pre-horse punch, I think. So we're good. We're good. We're good. This time, it's personnel. You'll never know. Well, Jesus, I see a thief. Excuse me? God. Come here, quick! Little There's a bit. thief over there! God damn it! What do you mean, dog? Have you lost your mind? Little bitch! Ah! What the? What the hey, fuck? You. God damn it! Halt. Surrender! You're under arrest for breaking the law! Little bitch! Ah! 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 ah. ah. Mother! Mother, please! <laughs> ah. Okay. We need to be more careful when we steal the axe. Even when we are uh, out of his line of sight, he still knows. So we just gotta wait for him to be even further. That's all. And then we'll be good. Kill him and ask him to pay for the debts. Maybe if we if we if we if we uh if we can just coax him into a brawl. 
Uh, then we probably won't have to worry about the guards, right? If we just beat his ass. Or he beats us up, alternatively. And then we can practice the combat without having a hatchet in our face. That would be good. Are we loading? Is he, um... Okay. This is what we're gonna do. Is it double crow day right now? Hip. I'm coming. Ba da -da 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 -da. Hello. God be with you, Kunesh. Hi, Kunesh. What do you father sent me. My father. I've got no. Pay or else. I knew you'd be trouble. Father says if you don't pay up, he'll come here himself and hammer those nails into your hairy ass. I'd like to see him try. Fuck off, you bastard, or your old man will be pulling those nails out of you. Now it's time. Pay, you monster. I must have misheard you. It sounded like you just told me to clear off. But you wouldn't be stupid enough to think you can steal, yeah. not pay your debts, and then try to scare me. Would you? You son of a whore. Yes. How dare you speak to me like that? I lost reputation, Didn't but that's okay. Did your father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Yes. Bye. And now we fight. Okay. That's not a good start. What the fuck is this? <laughs> this combat dog. It slows. It's got slow mo. Ah, God! The fuck is... Ah, oh. Oh, God! Oh, Jesus Christ. What is happening? Bitch! He's, how is he so good? I'm overfed? Yeah, I ate one carrot too much. What is that? <laughs> Bitch. 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 Ah, God. 3,000 hours in chivalry. Ah, Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> Ow. Oh, God. <laughs> Ah. Block and counter. How the fuck? <laughs> oh, I'm not even. I wasn't even locked onto him. Oh god. I hate that Q is. I might. I gotta change these fucking keybinds. Q is block chat. So weird. We're gonna do bad bitch. How? God damn it. Ah! Ah! You had it coming, you pup. And your old man can fuck off too. Mommy! <laughs> Mommy! Mommy! Where's my mommy? Mommy! Mommy! Huh? Ah, ma, I, I'm hurt. Bobby. Won't stop bleeding. Oh, now, stop squealing like a baby and show me that. There you are, good as new. You ought to learn to do that yourself. Thanks, ma. Thank you, Bobby. Daddy! Daddy, they beat me up. Dad. Yeah, about time. Have you got everything I wanted? No. <laughs> I had a fight. When I asked Kunish to pay, he fought me instead. That bastard. You don't look too bad, though. Did you get the better of him? I'm fine, but he didn't give me the money. Ah, it doesn't matter. I'll sort him out this evening. Bob. No time for him now. I'll rob him. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, 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 
Ahem. I will rob Kunesh! How about I don't talk to Kunesh at all, and just take back what you gave him? Rob him, you mean? I'm going to rob him! steal something that already belongs to you. And the thief can't complain you robbed him. Mm, fair point. But I don't think your mother would see it that way. I'm going to rob him of everything he has! Hey, villager, did you hear? I'm gonna go rob Kunesh! Let's do it. Sneaky now. <laughs> because robbing him worked so well last two times? Listen, dog. Everything is gonna be fine this time. Alright? It's a tutorial mission. This is how you know. This is what separates the man from the boys. Do you understand, homie? Hold on one second. We're going in, boys. sneaking music. What do you want? You have no business here. Oh. But where? Where can the hammer and nails be? They have to be inside his hovel. <laughs> you fool. <laughs> yes. from his pot. What's the locked chest? Oh, this? Oh. We have to get a lock pick, boys. Everything's gonna be fine. Fritz. I think that's one of our friends. I discovered the charcoal burner. Good. I don't have any money, though, sir. Hey, Pip. Do you want to learn something? No. I don't think so. Yeah. Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? Oh, it was nothing. <laughs> Covered Except with blood. <laughs> had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? Death. I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. But the world's a dangerous place, and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Yes, stick it in me. Yes. All right, I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. Hi, villager. Ooh, I don't belong here. Hi, shop guard. 
Just kidding, LOL. Skirt. New codex entry, Satin, Taylor. Damask, scarlet, to please the ladies. The ladies. Good day. Hi. Let's talk trade. Uh... I don't know what to do with fabric, sir. I'm sorry. Oh seven, oh three, twenty one. It ain't even July, homie. Where am I? You can't be serious, Deutsch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. I had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Not Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. He wouldn't even die. Counts. Traitor. Now even the Pope. God be with is you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsch is spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. Avignon. True, though. Winston is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik Month day year is the way. In chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to Either help your king. month day year South or year month day. Having no day first is the worst Putin. thing. Well, Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but Goodman Deutsch. This is Easily pointless. the worst of them all. Let us Correct. talk of more pleasant things. My words exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? Too I Matthew. Should give him a proper hiding. Ow! Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge parlor manure. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather touch it, to be honest. But, doing some turds will do. What do you say? <laughs> But I was going to get ale for her father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on. I'm bleeding. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all. I love throwing Man, poop. It's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? Well, I got to get a lock pick. I'll do it, but I need your help in return. All right, I'll do it. But then you have to give me a hand with something. What do you need? Kuna shows money to father and doesn't want to pay. I tried talking to him, but he wouldn't listen. I need more than words to get coin out of him, and I can't handle it on my own. No problem. We'll back you up. Just as soon as we're done. Well, no, I, I know. Just, okay, fine. Let's I'll throw some poop on it. Sort out that drunken elf. All right. Let's go while Deutsch is still sitting safely in the tavern. Yeah, that should go well. Hey, hey Henry. Henry's come to see us. Hey, it's me, Henry. Hey. And what in what way would having a day first make any sense? That's the least useful information, and you present it first. What? Eh? Wrong. True. Hey, Fritz. Listen, there's this locked chest I need to get into. Really? An only stray not good enough for you anymore. Oh my it's god, just it's that, that guy. Someone has something that doesn't belong to him. Ah! I want to take it back. <laughs> if you say so. It's not skin off my nose anyway. I've got some lock picks you can have. But if you get caught, 
You didn't get them from me. Yeah, never heard of you. Thanks, Fritz. Let's look at the date on this paper and see which day it was on. <laughs> Start reading it. 17? Okay, that's all I need to know. Don't need to read the rest of it. Absolute trash. You look at the month or the year first, and you immediately know without wasting any more time reading that date if you are getting what you want or you know you, you, your mind gets in the right mindset for what you're about to read next. Imagine reading that dog. Knowing the month, very important. The year, very important. The day, dog. No, 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 no. The 18th month of the year 21. It doesn't make sense, Siffy. They just don't make sense, dog. Wait, did he give me the lockpick? I wasn't even paying attention to what he said. So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? The Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? Okay. <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. Sorry, boss. I came two months late. Whoops. But I did come on the 17th, didn't I? You see your logic, Fraglomatic? You're a fool! You're a fool of a trick. Did I get a, uh, did I get a lockpick? I got Kun... <laughs> it's got... <laughs> this, this is straight up... Uh, the oblivion method of telling you it's stolen. I did get the lockpick. All right, we don't need to lure her away just yet. We got to go do that. I do like your month date the best. Japan has it right. I don't know what, uh, what other countries do it, but I do like the way they do it. Oh God, is my motion blur on? Oh no, I'm just I'm just super tired. Okay, <laughs> makes more sense. Look, dog, it's not my fault. They got it right. It ain't my fault, homie. It's also not my fault that this man's about to get robbed. Day, month, year, by far the worst. Alrighty. We pick. What the fuck am I doing? What the fuck? What the f what am I doing? What am I doing? What, what am I doing? Shut up, Jeb! In order to pick locks, you must have at least one lock pick in your inventory, although it's better to have uh, one or two spares since they get worn when you use... Worn with use, and in the worst case, they can break. So the actual lock press press with by holding E on the lock. You see a diagram of the lock mechanism, which you need to find the right spot to insert the lock pick. How close you are to the sweet spot is indicated by the size of the cursor, and it turns gold when you find it. Then you have to use the lock pick D to turn the whole lock mechanism. At the same time, you have to coordinate the movement of the lock pick with the rotation of the mechanism because the rotation shifts the position of the sweet spot. If you try to turn the mechanism without having the lockpick in the correct position, the mechanism will stick, which will damage the lockpick or even break it. Any, any damage to the lockpick will produce a noise, which can draw unwanted attention, and breaking it will cause an even louder snap. All right, all right. Let's do it, homies. Jesus Christ, that's hard because it's so sensitive. I'm in. Stay low. Stop! That's not the right way. I'm sorry. One beating wasn't enough for you, but you still owe my father. Hey. You don't get nothing from me. Tell that to your old man. I'm telling you, lay one finger on me and I'll have you thrown in jail. <laughs> Henry, I'm glad you came. 
Howdy. Greetings. I need charcoal, but I don't think I have any money. I would like to buy now. I'm buying one charcoal. Close the deal. Okay. Just like in real life. <laughs> Goodbye. Sell goods? Well, I got the stuff back. I don't know if I'm, I'm supposed to give that to my father or what. Sorry, horse. God damn it. I should have gotten more agility if that gives me more stamina. That's not what I want to look at. What do we got? We got buy the charcoal, buy ale, lure the ditch wife away, away, go to the sword fighting, pick up the cross guard. We got so many things to do. Hello. Twin adders are hippies? Well, yeah, they live in the forest. They're probably a bunch of elves, if you a bunch of dirty elves. Red buttons, laces, come, people, come. <laughs> He's got come. I'm in heaven. This truly is the best time to be alive. Laces, silk, come. I've got it all. Come one, come all. I don't want to. I don't want to uh, throw poop at the douche house just yet, though. Also, I gotta buy ale, but I don't have any money. Is that my woman? Woman. Bianca. I should probably clean myself up first. I am covered in blood. Yes. This is the way. I saw a trough somewhere. Oh, I think it was it was at the guy's house that we just stole from. We can wash ourselves off. Yes. You wash yourself as much as you can in a trough. Nice. Now we're ready. Smear poop on yourself and then talk to the lady. Yeah, I don't think I should do that. Let me let's see what my father if he, my father wants the stuff back. I guess I, I guess I can sell it. Also, you want me to trigger more Europeans in chat? Fahrenheit greater than Celsius in everyday living. Get wrecked, nerds. You're freezing at zero degrees Celsius, and then you're you're burning your boiling water at two degrees Celsius, dog. It don't make no sense, homie. It don't make no sense, dog. Hey, what up? About time. Have you got everything I wanted? Might as well just measure in Kelvin. True. I got everything from Kunish. Kunish didn't want to pay, so I got no money for those things. What do you mean reputation loss? Took them in lieu of the debt. Took, meaning he gave them to you, or took, meaning stole. Ship. If he didn't pay, then they're still ours. How can you steal something that's yours? Fair point. Give See? it to me then, and here's some money for the rest. Yes. I guess I could have. I guess I could have used Kunesh's axe. And maybe, maybe attacked with it. Nice. I gave it back to him. I mean, he's gonna know that it's gone. I got seven dollars. That doesn't seem like very much. How much charcoal am I supposed to buy? Ten? Hey. Let's talk. It costs, uh, okay. Uh, it costs seven gold. Oh, no, wait. It costs five gold. Oh, we finna haggle. Hold up. Let's talk about the price. Sure, why not? I'm cleaned up. Haggling works both ways, whether you want to buy cheap or sell deer. I don't know, hunt, though. Uh, you will select the amount you want to pay or get... W and S and confirm with E. The trader will then respond to, you, uh, respond to your offer. If the answer is refusal, he or she will make a counter offer and wait for your response. Interesting. So they have. So they do counter offers. I was wondering. 
slag mood in one direction or the other. It means either you are or the trader doesn't have enough money. If this ladder can't be moved, okay. Dragging out the haggling with uh, one offer after another will gradually try the uh, trader's patience and eventually they'll drop it completely. Okay. It lowers our reputation with the trader every unsuccessful bout of haggling. Okay, I was wondering if we would have to pay more if it did not go well. Let's see here. Uh, Let's just try four. Is this enough? That's not enough. Y'all yeah, right? That doesn't look good. How about this? How about this? Aye. For that amount, I can be persuaded. Nice! Done. I saved 0.6 groschen. Thanks. Here's your chain. She bought some stuff. Honestly? Even the tutorial town, I don't know how the rest of the game works in all the towns. I'm assuming it probably has a similar amount of quality as this town does. To it's it's more immersive than cyberpunk. <laughs> in Night City. 10% saving in olden days, Ross, dude. Charcoal burner. Havel. My queen. God save, my lovely. You're looking. I'm well not covered today. in blood today. <laughs> you too, handsome. Yeah. What brings you here? No poop on my hands either, dog. You do. Eddie, have you arrived at your next destination? Your beauty, of course. <laughs> oh, noble sir, I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my beauty. What else might your worship desire? I just bathed in a trough. <laughs> I changed your five degrees. We're entering a cataclysm. That's what I'm saying. Let's talk trade. Why is that grayed out? Oh. Tavern life. A skill book on drinking and alcoholism. What? A skill book on drinking. Eddie, you really should have a higher charge on your phone right now when you're flying. <laughs> Save your schnapps. You ghost wrote that book? Yeah. Drink better. Oops. Well, you your mom has that same book box eyes. stabs. Boy, mate. A pitcher for father. I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. God be with you, Henry. <laughs> but of course. Good luck. Thank you, my well, queen. Thanks. What did she say about the douche? It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Oh! Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening, I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. We've said that we've already... <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking... We've discussed this. After you. Vaniac. Celsius one. True. He's a man who makes his coin Although, if you think about it... Paris. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy uh, when he's gone for good. But that's pretty hot. <laughs> you up to with him. You know, that's you to teach one degree in Celsius... Sword. What use would that be uh, to shorts you? weather. Enough. Zero degrees. You sound just like father. Gotta wear my parka. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite, save your schnapps. Yes! Really? You're an angel. I love schnapps. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. Yes. I got five! Oh, the game saves automatically at point at important moments during quests and when you sleep in your own bed. Oh! Saving in this game is, is a currency? Oh. Okay. I, okay, that's weird. But I guess I get it. Hello. Uh, the douches. Let's see what she says about the douche. The douches mouthing off again. The douche. Oh, 
and talk to me about him? He's a good customer. But when it comes to politics, he's unbearable. Unbearable. A number of times I had to throw him and the others out so they wouldn't start brawling. Well, I'd say he's an exceptional form today. Just use Fahrenheit for weather. It's literally in most parts of the United States like a scale between zero and a 100. Fahrenheit's like 600? What? 600 degrees Fahrenheit? Just use miles per gallon? True. I pick these. They react. What? Oh, you wait. You can pick them. S somewhere. Where? What? Neat. Do 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 do. Use horsepower for temperature. True. All right, let's throw some poop at this guy's house. That'd be cool. All right, boys. Oh, you, oh, we have to lure her away. Hello, my lady. What do you want, lad? Your husband is doing stuff. I just went by the tavern, and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh... Well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard. Wenceslas. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty, the fool. <laughs> Next thing he'll start on about the popes. He might have mentioned the popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. Poop time. Although our Fritz guy is definitely going to set this place on fire. Nice, our game is saved. All right, boys. We lost reputation again. This cutscene's at 30 FPS. Ugh! What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and country! For king and country, my ass. This is all good, clean, fun. There's nothing clean about this. Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund! Woohoo! Eat shit, doshes! You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, Hans, can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern. Don't put your hand near your face. Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Horse Hans! Let's make those smites off your faces! Then oh. come. I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Zbizek. Hanging out with this poxy doisha? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> <laughs> Literal Fuck shithead. You. I'll make you pay for that. All right, here we go again. Oh, God. What up, dog? Fucking hell! What's the matter? Lost your balls? Yeah. Ah. I don't know what, what the penalty for just holding block is. There doesn't appear to be one. Uh. Little bitch. Okay. I'm coming, bitch. Ah! Run, oh, we gotta go this way. Scoot! We better fucking run too. <laughs> Got a blast. Hey, what's up? Good day, Henry. Good day to you, sir. Where's the catch pole? Only fight when they're looking the other way. That's the way, dog. That's how you play. All right, Matthias. Did, did we escape? Are we good? 
lot of smoke in the distance. I'm sure that's fine. Losing to boy 94. I just had to know if it could be done. Nickname unlocked. Beef tenderizer. Hmm. Very well. Stop feasting animals, pervert 94. Hey, I didn't do anything wrong. Hello. What? <laughs> Hmm. Mama Mia. Beep, 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 beep. Punch a guard? No, I've already seen what they can do. They can kill you instantly. I'm pretty sure I, I'm pretty sure I did that to you, sir. For goods and torches for the night. I have it all. Bum ba da dum boom ba dee dum da doo boop ba. What do we do here? Meet the lads at Kunesh's? Oh yeah, we're just gonna beat them up for some money. I think that sounds pretty good. I want to do sword fighting lessons first, though. Punch a chicken next, Palgers. So how's my how's my health doing? I got ninety nourishment. That's what I meant. Not my health. That ain't bad, I guess. Everyone's kind of cute when they die before turning thirty-five. Are you saying people are cute when they die? Um. <laughs> up sir so can we get started that's why we have to reproduce now we can good and since today's the last time we'll be seeing each other you can show me everything i've taught you so far uh oh very well oh god let's start with the basics keep moving your life depends on it oh geez Opponent, you're locked on your. Uh, you move around with A and D. We can break off by holding right, left right. shift. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Never repeat yourself. Boy, this is something right here. Slash. Good. Once again. Slash. <laughs> Now you're getting it. Slash. Now you're getting it. Slash. I was holding it down. Again. Slash. The point of the blade is for stabbing. Try it a few times. It is. Weak attack is the stab. Stab's going to be aimed at the face or the body. Fine. Stab. 9,000 hour Mordhau vet. Nice. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. Good. All right. Very good. I'm running out of stamina. That's enough. I don't know about you, but I'm tired and thirsty. Remember, though, train hard. No one becomes a master swordsman overnight. You have to work and work. What the? <laughs> Sorry. Sheep! Run! Lest I harvest your wool. They have bells on them, apparently. My dad's ale is probably warm by now. Oh, yeah. I did have her draw it cool. I didn't die. Okay. So, oh, oh, God. Help! 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 Alright, we're good. Fighting's a bit like For Honor? Yeah, I suppose. Uh, I gotta meet the lads now at Kunesh's, and we're gonna beat up this, uh, drunk man. Lads? Hello. 
What up? Well, we sorted that. Why Dagon Dogma? <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? No Dagon's Dogma. <laughs> oh, bastard didn't stand a chance. True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, let him. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Just a bit of fucking It's not that anyone really likes the Deutsch. Anyway, nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. <laughs> no one likes the Deutsch. Are we not going to beat up the guy anymore? I guess we don't need to since we stole the stuff. Hi, Fritz. Matthew. Very well, Mike. I have to go to the castle and get the thing. Yeah, I think it's... It, well, we live pretty close to the castle. That must be nice. I could dog mang... I could dog mang Daggins. How long is your layover, Eddie Lee? Beat him up and take his money. Bum -ba -doo -doo. Go to the castle to grab another sword. I love grabbing swords. Hey. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? No. Not yet. I'm working on it. And how much longer will it take? Get a move on. We have to finish that sword today. Or do you want me to look a fool in front of Sir Radzik? No, I don't. I'll be back soon. What about the ale? Alright, guess I'll keep it then. It's a little before I leave. Just like you. You're a little. That makes sense. Hark. Hi, Janik. I'll be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? I'm good. Uh, I came for the cross guard. Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzik, and the Chamberlain has the cross guard and pommel. Father had them engraved in Sassau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. When did I ever botch anything? <sighs> Where shall I start? Ah, shut up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Hurry up, mate. Mate. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I'd better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. I got the cross guard. I have everything we need. Father, did you see my sick jump? It was cool. I got it. About time. Yes, I have. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good the ale's job. important for sword Let's making. Have it then, son. Where have you been with that ale? It's as oh my God. As warm as horse piss. Go back and get me another. And you can pay for it yourself. Huh. That's the price of stupidity. Dog, I wanted it. I tried giving it to him. They actually thought of that. Nice. I tried giving it to him. He didn't want it, though. I gotta buy it. That's, that's pretty cool. Get dad some booze. God be with you, Henry. Flip off. Good health to you. What are you doing here? Fancy throwing a few dice? Oh, yes. Gamba. One dollar. Boy, I sure hope that we don't I don't get soft locked out of buying more ale. Take. Alright. May the best man win. Is this Yahtzee? Holy cow. Oh my god, it is Yahtzee. It's just straight up Yahtzee. It's called Farkle. <laughs> I love playing Farkle. Uh, the first to reach a certain number of points. Six dice are thrown uh, and the player alternates turns. Points are gained for every one or five thrown and for three or more of a kind of any other number. What is Yahtzee? 
it is basically this. So you get, you get the, in this case, five die. And you get a little cup, you shake it up, you put it down, and you have to get certain patterns or certain orders uh, to get more points. Um, and this one, it's straight up, um, it lets you get points just for, like, individual die. One is worth 100, and five is worth 50. Okay. Oh, interesting. Okay, but I guess two, three, four, and six aren't worth any individually. Interesting. And uh, three of a kind is worth 100 points multiplied by the given number. Okay. Interesting. Four or more of a kind is worth double the points. Nice. And so, yeah, you want to get, like, straights, uh, like, one through five, one through six. So I guess there's six die, not five die. Uh, that makes sense. But there, there's no full houses or anything. I don't think there's a full house in this, though, is there? There's the devil's head. You throw all six die, then you throw the remaining die. Once you you get to pick which ones you want to keep, and then you throw the dice again to try to get some patterns. The key element of the game is that if a throw does not produce a single scoring die, then the player's turn is over, and all points gained up to that point during the turn are lost. Oh, that's a big point of it. Uh. It is advisable to... Oh, okay. So that's interesting. So you actually have to choose when to end your turn to keep uh, your points. Otherwise, you might not get any. So you got to get you got to get at least a one or a five to keep getting points. Uh, and then you try to use that to pair up um, uh, three or fours of kinds and stuff. Interesting. Okay. Since every player throws his own dice, there is an, also an opportunity to cheat. What? We can find loaded dice and cheat. The devil's head is a set of dice with a joker instead of the one, which acts as a wild number in combination with any other number. But on its own, it doesn't have any value. Interesting. All right. So what I got? I got some ones already. Got some ones and some threes and a couple of sixes. So I can try. Uh, wait, did three of a kind count? Yes, it does. Okay. So we can take... Um, but the ones are, are actually the most expensive ones. Because they're worth 100 points. And I suppose twos are worth 20. Maybe. Loads of dice with malicious intent. Uh, let's try to get more ones then. Uh, hold that. And hold that one. Score and roll again. Boom! We got another one. Fabric, thread, buttons, laces. Come, we gotta get fourth. Come! Oh my god, I get to play in front of the come man. This is great. So we can. Um, I think I'm gonna roll again. I'm gonna, yeah. I'm feeling. I'm feeling lucky, boys. Roll again. If I was in your shoes, I'd pass while the going's good. Ooh. Uh, boom, boom. I guess I think we'll just score and pass. I got four ones and then a and then a five. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. So I will score and pass with a four of a kind with ones and a five. Okay. So what's he got? All right. What you got, dog? <sighs> this man just... Nah, this man's gonna bust. I can feel it. Did he bust? Oh, no. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! I'm glad you, stopped you fool. You don't even know, dog. He doesn't even know. All right, so this one's a little tricky. Uh, I think I'm going to do a similar thing. I think I'm just going to go with the ones and roll with a with a fat 40 right here, dog. Score and roll again. I'm busting! Now I could get cheeky and roll again. 
But I basically have to get a, um... I have to get like a three of a kind or a one or a five with these three right here. So one is the best and six is the worst. Uh, what's kind of so if I keep a so if I keep a if I this man's gonna bust I can feel it. Fuck you, Jeb. So if I keep a four for some weird reason, then it ne negates the score I have? Because it says my selected now is zero, even though I have a one. Any chance of finishing before curfew? Will you shut your goddamn gob? Um, no, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm just going to keep the threes. going to get a quick uh, cheeky one-er. Actually, I'm going to keep that one, too. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to keep a three of a kind. We're going to get cheeky. Scoring pass. Boom. A, a cheeky eight hundo. Mm-hmm. He's doing that thing again. No, the worst is the worst are twos. This would be the one. The worst are twos because you can only use two fours and sixes with uh, either straights. No, you. Which I'm not looking for at all. Which I should be. Or um, three or fours of a kind. Wow. Oh, look at this. Oops. Hold on. Well, see right there. See, so we got three of a kind for 200 right there. And we can keep that for a cheeky tour. Oh, wait. No, ones are the worst. Oh, no, 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 they're not. No, they're not. Wait, are they? No, they're not. Wait. Oh, I'm screwing myself over. Oh, I'm 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 screwing myself over with this. I could have thousands right now, because I've had three. I had four ones, but it only gave me four hundred. Because when I I thought that that would be a ugh, I'm an idiot. Because I ruined my four of a kind by just putting in a five, and so that made it that that, that turned it from four thousand to four hundred, or um. Like, uh, I guess 2,000, rather. It would have been 2,000 points the first time. Ah, oh, shit. So I, I could have had 3,000 score right now, but instead I have 800. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. All right. That's fine. Advice. Roll it again. Oh, no, I'm good. All right, that's fine. Uh, we're gonna hold, we're gonna hold the two, which is gonna give us a uh, four of a kind with twos, and I'm not gonna hold the f uh, the five this time. Um, combos are only counted per roll. Oh, so holding, oh, so holding four of a kind doesn't do anything. Oh. So that's so that's the difference. Really? So if I hold this two right now, it's not gonna give me four of a kind for twos. Oh, that's weird. So that's different than what I thought it was. Huh. Well, all right. High stakes Yahtzee. Yeah, so holding this this two doesn't do anything. Take a day or two, why don't you? Huh, okay. So I, I'm just going to hold this five then and just take the, uh, the 250. Because this isn't going to ruin that. I should get 250 if that's if that is indeed the way it works. Which it is. Okay, so I didn't mess up Frosty 2. So that's 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 tough. Oh jeez, that guy's got a lot of points. I get it. That is some high stakes Yahtzee. What the hell's with these damn dice? Oh nice. Okay. 
See, like right here. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, so yeah, right there is a cheeky uh, 1,050. And I'm not going to roll again. <laughs> I'm just going to hold that. Okay. So you can add to the combos like that. Got it. Boom. Okay, I get it now. It's, it, I was thinking Yahtzee rules straight up. Holy shit. We'll see. Wait, he can roll again? <laughs> After taking them all? What? This will be the one. What? What do you I mean? Have pushed it. But it's it's a little more it's a little weird. It's a little different than Yahtzee. Boom, boom. Come. See, we can just keep, keep get a cheeky 350 real quick. Can you feel him bust? Uh, I mean, I'll just take it, I guess. <sighs> Yahtzee's, Yahtzee's more forgiving than this. Can you hmm. score and roll again? Well, when you score, yeah, that's well, I mean, that's what he's doing right now. He's keeping that. He's keeping the score, and if he busts by basically not getting a three of a kind or a one or a five, hmm. man, he's doing it again. Oh my god, he got another one or a five rather. He shouldn't that's roll. It. He's gonna roll again. Did he just get a one? No, I'm no, he didn't. Chop. It looks like a one. That was weird. The AI, the AI plays very strangely. If all of your dice score, you get to roll all six again. Okay. Man, I can't believe he had one of those. That's crazy. And then he busted again. So that's how you keep rolling if all of your dice score. Why do you keep rolling? I don't know. Uh, just come now. Uh, roll again. I'm gonna get some cheeky scores real quick. Boom! Uh oh. Hardly worth talking about. But if you uh, you bust while keep rolling, he lose all the points. Yeah, that's what I just did. And that's what he did when he scored with all of his uh, all of his dice. Oh no! What a fool! I bet there's some good dice players out there. They probably do it very in skill. Can you bust? I don't think I've seen a roll without a one or a five. If I, I assume you can bust on the first roll. So you have to keep one. You have to keep one to uh, to roll again. Otherwise, I just pass. I see that now. Interesting. Fitty. Yahtzee doesn't have busting, does it? No, it doesn't. And and when you keep your dice, you uh you get to combine. So like you can you know keep two ones and then get two more ones and then you have a four of a kind. But that's not how it works in this. Uh, score and pass, cause we gotta get them points, baby. We're getting inching forward to four thousand. He's just gonna keep busting. I'm supposed to be. <sighs> Is there a day and night cycle right now in the tutorial? God's holy! <laughs> you idiot! You can get zero points in Yahtzee, though. Yeah, I mean, in theory, you can get zero points in this. I guess. I mean, you can get two twos, two fours, and uh, two sixes. You know, or two threes. You know, mix it up. Also, this is nice. Boom. Uh, gonna pass on this one. Skip. Close to winning. Hmm. You got three hundo. I don't even know why he bothers. Uh. No luck tonight. Can I just take? Can I take like? Okay, no, so you need a score to hold in order to roll again. So you can't just, uh, like, I can't just take, like, a, like a, 
a three, for instance, and then just roll all five again. I have to take the five to score uh, and roll. Okay. Come, people, come. But I also have this. This wins. Uh, skip. Holy mother of God, why do you punish me? I got a dollar, baby. Hell yeah. Victory. Hip. Excuse me, barmaid. Wife. Shouldn't you tidy yourself up a bit? What do you mean? I need ale. I'm back. I can see that. What's the matter? I need another pitcher of ale. The last one wasn't cold enough for father. You want me to get it for you? Right. And a smile from you. <laughs> God. <laughs> she, she stopped smiling awfully quickly. Here you are. Yeah! Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Oh, oh, oh. Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening, I'll have something more for you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can't wait. Point two Groshen. I'll be right back with that. I can send the TTS. And come. What does he have in the evening? He has a long stick. Also, when I played this game, I didn't even have my... T I, I played this game on an R9 390. Well, and I played the uh, tutorial briefly, and it ran very poorly. Near release on an R9 390. Fast forward three years, and here we are on a 2080 Ti. Ultra high. Or not actually ultra high. Very high. Uh, when I look at busy areas, I'm getting 80 frames, so it's still very demanding. But much more enjoyable than the brief time I spent with it. I got it. In yeah, about sense. time. Have you I got pennies. I have. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Well done. Check. Right. If ale Some equals piss warm, did for fail us. quest. Look at that, lad. That's oh. what I call craftsmanship. Wow. What does the inscription mean? Damn if I know. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Lord Rudzig ordered it. Oh, this will be the finest sword I've ever made. Have you got the charcoal? Good. And fire up the forge. We'll put it all together. I had a gamble, Siffy. Boy, this game must be very long. <laughs> Especially if you fuck around like I have done. By the way, someone paid me a call. I reckon you might know what it was about. I'm not sure. Really? Because I'm pretty sure you and your friends threw dung at Deutsch's freshly whitewashed house. He was here with the catchpole earlier, and it was not a friendly visit. What got into you, Hal? I guess I probably could have done... That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the king. Probably could have not done that quest, I assume. Deserved. Got what he deserved, did he? You can go and clean up the mess you made and apologize to him. I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody, least of all the king. You understand? The German. Yes. Look me in the eye, Henry. Do you understand? I understand. What do you mean, Giga? And we'll never have this conversation again. Eddie, stop. So you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of our king? Stop beating people up. The boy gets caught making a fool of himself, and he still hasn't learned his lesson. So Deutsch spouts rubbish and war. You turn into a common thug. You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, 
Try using your mouth, and not your fists. That's literally my entire character build. I put no points into strength, or agility, or vitality. <laughs> and I didn't talk so myself out of anything. Right, we'll do the grip. In this tutorial. Literally nothing. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. This looks dangerous. I'm not wearing gloves. Do it. This looks so dangerous. Good. Once more. Oh, God. <laughs> That's it. Done. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the guard. Holding it like towards his crotch. Oh God. Father, why did you leave Prague? Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I had my reasons, Hal. And here, I have your mother and you. Why would I want any other life? I don't know if I would want me. Do you remember Emperor Charles? TBH. I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague and a score of castles, had a bridge made over the Moldau, and founded a university. And all without a war. He knew how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. But Wenceslas doesn't have it easy. It's hard to step into the shoes of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Mm -hmm. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here. I didn't do anything to it. it. Together. I did. I did. I I chopped off like half of a side. <laughs> oh God! I Man, is that really how the handle's gonna look? This is the best sword you've ever made, huh? All right. It's magnificent. Indeed, it is. The Lord be with you. My father sent me for those nails. Good day to you, Teresa. They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Theresa. That would slide out of his hands easily. I might. Is there a mod to save anywhere in the world? I might want to do that because I, 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 look, I, I thought about sh punching so many people, but I only have five saves. <laughs> Hello, mother. Is everything all right, son? Take care. Boop. That was one of the first moss people made, I bet. Nails for Theresa. Ooh, some savior schnapps. And a marigold concoction. Within one minute, we'll add 30 health and dispel hangover effects. And bandages. Can I use these? Yes. I'm gonna drop... Uh... I can drop some savior schnapps in there. I can make a savior... A save game stew. I got three more saves, yo. Oh, I see. Very well. Ba ba bo dop. Do 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 do. Scoop. Henry, Henry right? what are you waiting for? <laughs> Bring those nails. What? Oh. 
Here are those nails you wanted. I got them, Theresa. Thanks. So, how's Bianca? Um, she's fine. Why do you ask? Just wondering. Will that you be going do. to the dance Go this evening? Go and get those damn nails. I ha just gave them to her, Maybe father. We'll see each other there. Anyway, mustn't keep you. I'll be on my way. That sword is truly beautiful. God damn! Fine lass, eh? Now stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. Wow. <laughs> we did a fine job. Amazing. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned swordsmith. Hi. Well, those days are gone, sir. Hmm. You haven't lost your skills, though. Wrapped. It is wrapped. Would you like to try it? Sir, what good is a sword to a commoner? try it. Dude, we're about to break it. Oh my god. The happy Gilmore. What are you doing? You still have a lot to learn. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life. What so, the fuck was perhaps. that? <laughs> but who knows what the future holds for each of us. I see that you almost have it finished. It just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work. Very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Svan? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. How pew pew oh, to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. That's what I said. A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. Here you are. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. I'm sure our paths will cross again. They certainly will. Bye. Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Is it not ready now? Good work, Martin. Sure. It's been an honor, Sir Isfah. Have a safe journey to Sasau. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. He's shaking. It needs polishing. A long peculiar history. I'll polish you, Siffy. That was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Will you teach me how to use it like Sir Radzik said? Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. Oh. You know the trouble with an adventurous life, son? It can end before it gets <sighs> started. I might teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. You talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in Scalitz, here, beneath the linden tree, and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them, or beat them. Meet. You beat their meat. About it. <laughs> then you've no need to learn swordplay. A messenger. He was in a hurry. What's happened? Monker Giga. The horn of... The horns of Ministereth. Oh no! The Hungarians! Look, dog. There's no need to get violent. That seems a little overkill. Mm. 
Well, listen to me, Al. Listen carefully. Take the sword, go into the house, and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry. And what about you? Yeah, all right. Your mother is in the village. I'll fetch her and we'll follow right behind. I'll go with you. No. You'll do what I say right now. Give the sword to Sir Redzik. I took everything from the chest. He'll take care of you. He owes me. Okay. They should have probably worked on that. Bullshit, I took everything from that. Why are they doing this? I enjoy J Debs. Quickly! We have to close the gates! Move! Come on, we're closing! Move in, people! Come on! We're running come out of on. time! Oh, Henry! Thank God! Get inside quick! We have to shut the gates! Get running, people! Come on! Mind this for me! Are you mad? You can't go back! He took my bag. Get through the gates! Papa! Papa! Oh shit. Goddamn Hungarian. Hungarian destroy my wall. Papa. Oh no, he got smacked in the back. Hello. Nice block. No, mama. Seems again a little overkill. How you know he's evil? Because they wear red. Find a horse! Ride to tell Merc! Tell them what's coming! Warn them! Run by the moats! There's the path down there! Jump down from the wall and flee! Boop, 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 boop! Got a blast! That's my sword. Yeah, I'd say that was an unexpected visit. I got it. Drawn weapons cause fear amongst villagers. Ride to Talmberg and get a horse. Where's Talmberg? That's that way. I learned Cummins. The Cummins first arrived in Czech lands in 1260 under the leadership of the Hungarian crown prince Stefan. They fought against Bishop Bruno and the army of the Austrian lords, which they thoroughly vanquished. Now I understand why I must deliver upon the Cum Man. <laughs> What? Don't worry, boys, I got this. That is bad. I didn't mean to be doing this. I didn't mean to be doing this, dog. Oh, God. I didn't mean to be fighting. God I damn, it makes me kind of want to. I wish I was playing chivalry. Holy fuck. <laughs> 
a Mordhau veteran. I can't fight him. I was trying to press, I tried pressing right click to block and then it locked me in into a 20 second swing stab yeah. animation because I'm playing a medieval neat character. Just draw their attention. I will draw their attention with my blade. I know I just draw their attention. I showed you of all people should know, Berna, that I know what to do. <laughs> hey, bitch. What? What the fuck? What is the? What the fuck? Why am I looking at stats of the horse? Oh god, here we go again. God, this fucking. Why is E the stat button? Are you fucking serious, dog? What is X whistle and ride? Why would it not be E? What literally every game does. Right, sorry, my bad. Should have known it was X. Fuck you, chat. You suck. You'll never be as good at Mordhau as I am. 10,000 hours. How am I going this way? My eyes. Screw you, Berna. They don't speak English. Fuck you, bitch. X is mount. You can call your horse anytime by whistling and then mount it. Wasta. Caps walk gives your horse a chance to recover. W plus left shift canter ideally combines a faster pace. W plus left shift, left shift. Gallop is the fastest gait. We can hold left shift. Our horse is smarter than some people and will stick to the path if you're on it and give him his lead. Just begin counter cantering. Very well. Easily done. I assume... Did I save her? I think I did. They weren't actually following me. I think I did though. I didn't whistle. I, I absolutely did whistle. It even gave me a check mark that I did do it. I literally did it correctly. Hi. I literally did it correctly. But I'll wait, I'll do it again, chat. Why are you not charging your phone, Eddie? Why are you not at an outlet right now? Why did I get off my horse? Because I tried pressing X to whistle again, but that was not the correct move. <laughs> You're on a plane. Why Why didn't you charge while you were in the airport? Why, why are you... Why are you still on a plane for hours? Why didn't you just drive to another airport where they had a direct flight to Vegas? Eddie, why do you do these things? Go to hell, you beast. Eddie, please. Watch, I'll whistle again at their faces just for you. Look, they're out. See, I'm right again. Beep. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. But this time they're chasing me. Your RNG insane. We're good, boys. They can't catch us. We're too fa Ah! This man's getting stabbed. What language are they speaking? My leg! What the? Oh god. I'm bleeding! I can fix it though. Can I fix it while I'm riding? <laughs> no, I cannot. 
I can't use it while I'm in combat. Fine. Skip. Ah! Yeah. Excuse me. The hell? Don't do it, dog. Left. Almo gets to the left along the stream. Oh no. They come. Scoop. Warn the others. They've torn Scarlet. Goodbye. Yeah, that guy's probably dead though. <laughs> Why wouldn't they shoot him? For the lols. It's a pretty game. I feel like if it's done well, I feel like like uh, being a trapper and a hunter in this game or something would be pretty cool. I can make them canter behind yeah. me too. Oh god! Excuse me. No, do not trap raccoons. Excuse me. Flee, you fool! Do not shoot me. That's cringe. Run for it. Yes, I'm happy, Eddie. You need your phone charged for when you arrive. Ah! My eyes are getting bloody from my bleeding leg, chat. Help. What do you mean, stop looking backwards? Wrong. I literally do it so I can canter and get some uh, stamina back for my horse. And then I sprint when they start aiming. Ah! Don't call me a hoggy. Do something! Do something! Fire at the one in front. Good luck, Eddie. Let us know when you have arrived. Safe and sound. Quickly, we're closing the gate. Please. When this game was, I didn't realize this game would have such a um, maybe so heavily heavily story focused. Someone give him a drink and bring hot wine and bandages. Can hot wine be the bandage? Tell me, boy, who are you? And where are you from? What in hell's name happened? I've come from Scalitz. They burned it to the ground. Slaughtered everyone. Who? Who burned it to the ground? A huge army. They attacked without warning. And, and they weren't Czechs or Germans either. Who then? I don't know. Come, man. I've never seen armor like it or heard their language. Maybe Tartars? Tartars, you say? Yeah. Well, we'll deal with that later. First, let's have a look at that leg of yours. They come for the dentists. I, I don't know. The Tartars. Grit your teeth, boy. I'm gonna pull that arrow out. That's a bad idea. Yeah. Goodbye. Hello. Easy. All done. You were lucky, lad. The arrow missed the bone. It only needed bandaging, and I've done that often enough before. War is a good teacher. Can you stand? There you go. Good as new. 
Thank you. If you idle, there's nothing better to do. Get back to work. You'll have to speak to Lord Divish. Can you manage? <laughs> Divish, I have come for you. Sir, this is a survivor from- I heard, Robart. Tell me, boy, what exactly happened? Did you see the insides of the attackers? And were there any more survivors? So, um, I don't know what army it was, but it was huge. There were dozens of banners flying on the hill above Scalitz. The ones who did the slaughtering spoke a, a, a strange language. Mm. They burned Scalitz to the ground. But a lot of people took refuge in the castle. I wasn't quick enough. And as I fled, they shouted from the battlements that I should come and warn you. The soldiers the boy didn't recognize. They could be those Cumans of Sigismund's. They're coming. It said they came to Hungary from the east, and now they're the core of his army. Is Hungary Mordor? Second <laughs> Gutenberg must have given him a taste for stolen silver. Scalus is a small castle, sir. If Sigismund attacks, they can't hold. Indeed, Sir Robard. And our small garrison would be no help, even if we could risk sending them. You think we're next in line? Maybe. What's your name, boy? I'm Henry, son of the Scalitz blacksmith. Hmm. I know him. Did he make it inside the castle? I'm sorry. It's in God's hands now. No one else can help us. Anyway, thank you. Well, who's who's his voice actor? Your neck to warn us. Is he young? Robard, take care of Henry. Make sure he gets something to eat and some rest. Yes, sir. And get all the people inside the gates. We have to prepare for the worst. Make all the necessary arrangements. As you command, sir. <laughs> Shanty's older than 30. Hold on, I'm, I'm looking it up. I gotta talk to Sir Robard. Thankfully, they patched me up. I did bring my own bandages. Uh, let's see here. Hold on. Oh, I see. Well, remind me the week before he arrived, so I'll have time to Boom. For his visit. Of course. If this is the same guy, his voice actor is, uh... I mean, now he... At, at the time when this game came out, his voice actor was 54 years old. So, hey, man's got an older voice, I guess. Dan Brown. Ooh. Well, all righty then. This is what I'm talking about here. Oh, God. Yes. Eat. <laughs> yes. Food. Hey, what's up? I sure wasn't the other guy. Nope. Dan Brown voice Sir Robard Davish. Or Davash, whatever his name is. Divish. I'm in a private area. Well, so what? I, I got some food in my pocket. Hold on. Probably. I stole a lot. Uh, let's eat some lentil soup. Hmm. Eat some carrots. Oh, did I? I think I drank some marigold concoction on accident. Why is my speech so bad? Am I injured? Still, was that why? What is it? Where can I see my status effects? Minus one? I'm drunk? Did I just drink booze? <laughs> oh, I drank wine, I guess. Okay. Where can I see that I'm drunk? Buffs? 
I'm hot. No, I'm, no, I'm just hungry. I'm hungered, hungry and tired. And tiredness, tiredness affects my, uh, my charisma. No, I'm not drunk. I'm tired and hungry. Please tell me what happened to Scallops. I have kin there. Stop stealing? Uh, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a very much degenerate man. Hopefully I can eat other people. Hello, winch. It was awful. They torched Ravna on their way. It seemed like any other day. And then I saw thick smoke rising above the hamlet of Rovna. Soon, Sigismund's army were finished there and came for us. The order to attack must have come even before the alarm bell rang. God preserve us. How, how, would, that, how would there have been a fail? I fled to the castle, but my parents, they weren't Goog. We all ran towards the castle for shelter, but they were too fast for us. My girlfriend died? Did we, see, caught, did we see Did we see Bianca die? Houses. I barely escaped, and they... In the cutscene? They killed... They murdered my parents. Teresa lived. God bless you, boy. I'm terribly Presumably. sorry for your loss. Oh, God damn it, my stomach hurts. I mean, I ate some lentil soup. I don't know how to make my own food. Bob would always go to... Ye old McDonald's. Hi, Chamberlain. Hello. Hey, Sir Divish. Was that? What do you want? You've no business. Excuse me. Damn. What? Oh God. What? I. What do you mean? I'm not allowed in there. What was that noise? There's a wait. Is there a pretzel stand? Or do I get? How do I get the pretzels? Hit on everybody and assume she's dead. That sounds like that'll come and bite me in the butt. Is this a bed, sir? I can knock him out. Yeah, I doubt I can. Is this a chest? Hey! Ah! It's very dark over here. Wasn't Divinish, Divish the one with the weird uh, voice? Uh, yeah. Isn't that the one that Dan Brown voices? I thought it was. His name is Ro. Is his first name? Was his name Robard? I looked up. I guess they're Robard. Divish? Or is this Robard? Oh shit, I looked at the wrong one. I see, wait, yeah, who's. Oh fuck, I fucked it up. I also dropped my phone. Alright, someone else is gonna look him up. I was wrong. What in heaven's name happened there? I'll tell you about it. It was awful. They torched Ravna. It seemed like any other day. God preserve us. I don't know what the point of saying this is, but I'm gonna tell her all about my troubles. We all run towards. They murdered my. God bless you, boy. Do I get skill improvements for that? You've done well, lad. I'm sorry for your loss. You must be all done in. Why don't you go to the kitchen and have a good meal? Sorrow is easier to bear on a full stomach. Truth. Ugh. I heard about your father. They say he was a swordsmith who moved to the countryside to make horseshoes. Is he going to the. Oh, he's going to the kitchen, I think. I can't understand why he waited his talent, but I'm sure he had his reason. He had a fine reputation. It's a great loss. Ah, uh, Milady. Milady? You're fortunate our good lady Stephanie of Talmberg has graced us with a present. Mamma mia! Lady, I'm honored. So this is our brave young man. Hmm. Welcome, lad. Bojana here will take care of you. Bojana? No doubt you're tired and hungry. Au revoir, Indeed. Bojana. How can he not be, poor soul? After everything he's been through, he must be as hungry as a bear, aren't you, young master? Yes, mate. Oh, I am. Here you are, then. Eat your fill. Put your face a into wine the bowl. To wash it down. Yes. Thank you. Well, All of the above. <clears throat> when you're done, you can go and rest with the grooms in the outer bailey. No, that won't do, Sir Robard. 
After all he's been through, he deserves a proper bed. You're lying, hag. Let him sleep in a lodge in the courtyard. Certainly will they do. Young Henry here is overwhelmed by your generosity. Oh, yes, yes. Thank you, my lady. May God reward you for your kindness. Eat up now. You're in capable hands, so I'll leave you to it. Good night. Good night. Good night, ma'am. When you've done, you can sleep in the bedchamber of the courtyard lodge. No, Berna. And don't forget to take off those filthy boots before getting into bed. I refuse. I've only stolen a little bit, okay? I wish to become the town drunk. Oh, lentil mash. Roast Duke. Ugh. My my eyesight, bro. Bread roll. Objective complete eat. I didn't, though. I wish to eat the lentil mash. Mmm. Roast duck. Mmm. 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 I have 17 energy. Does it use... Does it use my, um... Uh... Oh, my God. I'm <laughs> falling asleep. Does it use energy to eat? <sighs> you must dream of cute owls. Oh. Oh. What was it? Mm. Cheese. Uh, I need some coffee. Apple. 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 <laughs> this human food, lentil mash, is delicious. Thank you, my lady. Eat from the pot. <laughs> God be with you. What can I do for you? Uh. Let's, where can I buy something? If I needed some food, who should I ask? Who do you think, young man? Me, of course. And if you want something extra, I could help you out with that too. Mamma mia. God bless. She, she does sell pretzels. And sweet pancakes. I didn't realize pretzels were such an old food. <laughs> I have to sleep now. Hello. I think I gotta sleep upstairs. I have to go to the courtyard lodge. I wonder if I can just fall asleep where I stand. Ah! Of course, baked bread is. I'm in a private area, by the way. Ah. Very hard. What do you mean it's too difficult? You don't know unless you try. I can't attack that. <gasps> I want these, bro. I love weaponry. Hit. I must buy sex from the old lady. But what do you mean? Steal all the arms? I can only have two, though, prostitute. Left and right. I have to go to the courtyard lodge. I'm tired. I'm literally going to pass out where I stand. This has to be correct, right? No. Why am I stealing? I'm not... Well, I mean, I, not at the moment. I'm not stealing anything. Okay, this is not correct. I guess it's in this building, maybe. I have to go in. Yes, we use this ladder, of course. <laughs> Oh, yes. If you are tired, your stamina and eloquence will also gradually decrease. Sleep is the solution. I wonder if we can be stupid and have, like, Fallout New Vegas responses. Oh, I can I can sort of see things through, uh... <sighs> sleep. Jesus. Is this a man coming in? I could really do with some sleep. Hey! What? You've no... Damn. 
What are you doing here? I'm sleeping. Sleep. Twelve hours of sleep? That sounds about right for our character. Ah. If you see anything out of the ordinary, report it immediately. Understood. Yes, sir. Yes? We didn't get any sleep. It is I, Henry. Oh. <gasps> Forgive the intrusion. I didn't wake you, boy. My lady. Did I? Uh, my lady. Uh, <laughs> um. No, no, not at all. But what brings you here at yes, this time? Yes, Jeb, of course. I thought you could do with a little wine. It's just what you need to help you sleep. My lady, um, thank you. You really shouldn't. You could have sent a servant. I was going to, but to tell you the truth, I couldn't sleep either. I thought of you while saying my prayers. How awful it must have been for you. New wife? I came to offer you solace. To let you know you're not alone. We're starting medieval Mormonism, boys. Thank you. Thank you kindly. You're welcome. Now, Henry, I know this is all very new and strange for you. She touched our hand. But I want you to feel at home here. Marriage? You're not to worry about anything except getting better. Oh. God knows you've been through a terrible ordeal. I know what it is to be left alone in the world. Although your loss is much greater. But with God's help, the pain will ease in time. And it can help to talk about it. If you feel like it. Prostitute, why? Tell the story of the raid. You might be right, my lady. What is this at camera angle? I'll tell you what happened. It was terrible and unexpected. The day started just like any other. Sir? Father sent me into town on some errands. Uh, I met my friends, and we went to teach. I met my friends oh. right next to the Scalitz. Henry! When we heard Deutsch praising Sigismund, our blood boiled. My mates decided to teach that fool to mind his tongue. Sir? So, thanks to us, Deutsch had I'm, this great I'm invisible. his newly whitewashed house. How foul. No! When I'd done all the errands, I headed back Oh, I'm home. over there. I promised father I'd help him with his work, and I was looking forward to it. He was I don't think I'm supposed to be over there. Him. Father and I always chat in the forge. On that particular day, I asked him if he'd teach me swords. Oh, she has very high combat. He said no. He said it's better for a man to keep his head on his shoulders than lose it over some pointless heroism. If only you'd known what fate had in store for us. Oh. New perk point available. Nice. Was already I should on have done horizon, this one. Ready to attack the town. I saw smoke on the horizon from a village Sigismund pillaged on the way to our town. Which was soon to meet the same fate. God have mercy. And then death descended on Scarlet's. The Scarlet's people. I saw Deutsch trying to defend himself. The man who'd mocked King Wenceslas as a drunkard and we're, praised. We're, we're circling back. Now stood facing his soldiers with nothing but a pitchfork, trying to protect his wife and son. It was hopeless. He slaughtered them all. That's so sad. Nice. I ran Riding to the castle wrong. like our neighbors to take cover, but I didn't make it. I had to find another way to save myself. The men on the battlements called down to me to flee to Talmberg and warn you. I was lucky I knew a concealed path around the castle. The commons were plundering the village. I wasn't safe yet. 
The Cumans were going from house to house below the castle, looting and then torching them. We're no, we know they're they the Cummins the now. Castle, and it was clear they could spot me at any moment. May God punish them. Then I heard a scream. It was Teresa, the mill wench. She'd been caught by a gang of Cuman savages who planned to violate her. Oh. I had Sir Radzik's sword, and even though there were several of them and they were better armed, I had to try and save her. I wanted there to be at least one person I'd helped. And I succeeded, even though it almost cost me my life. After that, I stole a horse from them and rode off. Like a valiant knight. I'll never forget the horror. It will haunt me for the rest of my life. I bravely retreated. That's terrible. How could something like that happen? God alone knows why he lets such things happen. Oh, you poor boy. I understand your grief, but God is not to blame for the ills of this world. That is the work of Satan and Satan. those who do his bidding. Those who are corrupted by greed, envy, and pride. You must not lose faith, whatever life brings. Help me. Help you. Fate has not been merciful to me and my husband either. Although in comparison to the horrors you went through... Show her your sword! I was young when I married my husband. It was my father's wish. Divish was a lot older than I, but a woman must bear her lot. Shortly after our marriage, before I even got a look at Talmberg, the castle was stormed and my husband was imprisoned. Talk about Sir Razig sword twit really? sensor. Come on. My husband had some quarrel with Sir Havel Medek of Valdek, who decided to resolve it by force. Sir Havel. He stormed the castle, burned down the village of Probislavitz, and killed many of our men, even the old chamberlain. He imprisoned my husband in the castle and put his own garrison there. That's awful. I was barely 18 years old and... It just went down to 28, Frosty. All of a sudden, I was left alone with Sir Robert. We didn't know what to do. 28? We went to Prague to appeal to the king and sought help from Divish's friends, but all to no avail. We tried for years, but it seemed I was destined to be left alone and my husband to rot in jail in his own castle. Years, you say? Seven years. That's how long it took before Havel was condemned as an enemy of the crown. And even then, he refused to surrender the castle and release my husband. In the end, I raised the money to pay a ransom. And only then, by the grace of Lord Jesus, did I finally lay eyes on my husband once more. Baby Jesus in the sky. Years. And was Harvel punished for it? Never. And after seven years, my husband returned to me an infirm old man. <laughs> Thirty-two so he was. Seems like a good, strong man. Well, certainly. Only he has many concerns. He had to rebuild Talmberg. After he was released, the king appointed him Burgrave of Prague Castle, and he was very busy. He had no time for me at all. But at least we were in the city, and there was something going on. And now, we're here. My lady, you're still young and beautiful. Your best years are still ahead of you. Would that that were true, lad. Would it were true. But what am I doing bothering you with this? You have troubles enough of your own. I'll go and let you sleep. I enjoyed our little talk, Henry. Good night, and God bless. Good night, my lady. She does. Would that were true. His sword's in the corner. She's married. Eh, it's one of those medieval marriages, you know. <laughs> no, red, 
red everywhere. No. Henry. And you always will be. Henry, wake up. You don't want to miss this. What is hmm? that? What's happening? Come to the battlements. One of our patrols reported a company heading here from Skelets. Ah. Blah. We ran away. Bravely, ex maced The lady said so. I have the torch. If you need a torch at night, use a torch by holding one. Ah! I opened the door with my torch hand. I'm going out into the rain. That looks pretty nice. You'll see all your equipment with detailed descriptions. Here you can also change our character's outfit. If we take off all our clothes, we're less visible. And there's a there's a conspicuous meter. Interesting. Owl potion you may see at night. There is no night owl potion. Punching random animals. Frosty hoot. How could you say these things? There is no owl potion. You lie. Where's my sword? May it be a light for you in dark places when all other lights go out. Dog, they didn't just give me a Lord of the Rings reference and I, my immersion is shattered. No, they did not. <laughs> they actually didn't. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Come now. All right. They actually did it. That's what uh, that's what the crazy blue elf lady tells old Frodo when she gives him the vial of blue that lights up. You know the ones. May it be a light for you in dark places when all other lights go out. Yeah, all right. I gotta go upstairs. Ba -ba -bum. The battle bots! My frame! Good day to you. What do you need? I, what's going on? Do you know what's happening? No. Okay. What about you? Me? How could I? I saw you with the robot. Didn't he tell you anything? No, nothing. <laughs> hmm. Am I an Oblivion NPC? Take care now. Maybe I should download the HD textures. But don't be taunted by their numbers. Heed my commands. 40 frames well. per second. Maybe I shouldn't. Hi. Hey, you men down there. Tell the people outside the walls to prepare for attack. Quickly, do you understand? Ow. Sir Robert, what's going on? What's going on? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Why would Sigismund advance on Talbot tonight? Especially since he's lost the element of surprise after the raid on Scouts. Maybe it's not him. Then who is it? The Scouts Givish sent to Scarlet to spy on Sigismund, said he'd set up camp and was getting ready to storm the castle. And Sir Radzig is an experienced soldier. He'd surely hold the castle for quite some time. It doesn't make sense. What else did the spies see? Not much of anything. 
Before they could get close enough, this huge storm started. And you were right. Sigismund has a hell of a lot of soldiers, including all manner of mercenaries. An army like that costs a fortune. No owl. But anyway, we'll find out when they get here. Only Close. crow. Aye, be well. I'll be with you. Oi. 144 FPS cutscene? It's weird how some, some are unlocked and some are at 30. Halt! Who goes there? Lucifer and all his minions! Who else, Robber? Sir Antic. What a relief. Hey! Is the Lordship there with you? Yes, sir. He is right here. What are you doing up so late, Divish? At your age, you need a good night's sleep. <laughs> well, Rantic, you didn't exactly pick the best time for an outing either. <laughs> well, Rantic. It was a bit of a scramble, all right. Believe it or not, this Tempest is a godsend for me and my men. As my old granddad used to say, better a sore throat than a slick throat. I'd say your grandfather was a wise man. Your messenger told us what happened. Messenger? The lad you sent to warn us. He's alive? He made it to you? He's here with me. He only got away by the skin of his teeth, though. Thank God. A brave young man. But tell me, friend, how on earth did you manage to get away? Thank God for this tempest. When it began, Sigismund's Tatars crawled into their holes and left the storm in the castle for more clement weather. We were able to sneak out right under God, I'd be so pissed if I was one of those guards. Like, come friends. on, let's we go. We a chance against them. Would you like to spend the night in Tumber? No, no. When Sigismund finds the castle empty tomorrow, he might come looking for us. We'd only be exposing you to danger. Without me and my men, he has no call to attack you. Well, what will you do then? We'll march to Ratai. It's only a short way, and there we'll have a better chance of defense and enough room for all of these people. If Sigismund should come, better bend your knee, Divish. There's no point dying in a battle that's futile. You're right there. Is that boy still with you? I'm here, sir. You have courage, lad. That I can't deny. But I can't fight I for a sword. Sorry about what happened. Worth shit. Would you care to join us? I'd like to, sir, but first I have to return to Skalitz. Are you mad? What do you want there? I can't leave my mother and father. I won't leave their corpses rotting in the street. I'll join you once I've taken care of them. Don't even think of going back there, you donkey. Are you <laughs> tired of living? Gordon? Sir, quiet! I'm sorry about your father, but getting killed as well won't help him. Divish, make sure that lad doesn't budge from Talmberg until things quieten down. Not to worry, friend. Anyway, he's injured and needs to recover. I'll lock him up here as if he were Havel of Baldic. <laughs> I see you've grown a thick skin since your tribulation, sir. But thank you. We'll meet again when circumstances are more favorable. Farewell. Farewell, friend. And good fortune. Give my regards to Sir Hanish. I will. And good luck to you and your people, too. These are dark times. I like the first couple seasons of Game of Thrones. Too bad they never finished it, you know? Siffy attacked this man. Get him! My Man, friend! Tonight we'll have triple patrol. Sort out the watches between you as always. And if I catch anyone boozing, playing dice or slacking off, dice? I'll personally break every bone in his body. I want you to keep a close eye on everything nearby. Sigismund will surely have sent spies, and likely men as well, to follow the Scalas people, now he knows they've fled. Keep your eyes peeled, and report everything to me at once. Understood? Yes, sir. What is it you need? I could use an extra pair of eyes, and yours are keen. Will you keep watch at the battlements with my men? Is that a request or an order? I'd rather it was a request you answered yesterday. Of nice. course I'll help. I'll have to pay you back somehow after all you've done. Well done, Siffy. Splendid. And don't worry. I'll tell the men to relieve you later. Really? Oh my god, men are relieving me? Siffy, can you change your grand company in FF14? I gotta keep watch on the battlements, yo. 
I can't see anything out there. I do see some mans, actually. I think I'm gonna catch a cold. Hello. My respects to you. What do you think about that? What do you think about that surprise during the night? I was surprised, all right. <laughs> I'm glad them people were safe, though. I'm just as glad it weren't Sigismund. For sure he'll come here in the end, too. But now at least we've got time to get ready for him. Maybe he'll leave Talmberg B. Maybe, maybe not. Could be he was only out to get Sir Radzi, because he's Wenceslas' headman. The Scarlets is a rich town, so there was plenty of loot for the taking. Two birds with one stone. Wandering around like a stray sheep. Must be your first watch, eh? Yes. I don't think anything much will be happening today. You can just lean against the wall and wait till morning. I'll show you what's what. I will. <laughs> All right. If you have to wait for something, you can skip time. Nice. Ah! The sky is flashbanging me. He will show me what's what. Good health to you. Hello. Uh, let's wait five hours. End of watch. What? Uh-oh. <laughs> There's not the end of watch. Let's go. Maybe I should have... I don't have night vision, Frosty Hoot. Let's go! Let's go! Move it! Quack! Go, Quack! Go. Quack! Hut, 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 hut. Ah! <laughs> oh, hey, the rain's gone. I wasn't sleeping, I was waiting. Also, that's not good. self-appointed king wins the love and respect of his loyal subjects. Indeed, Robard. Sigismund of Luxembourg has a rare talent for winning people over to his cause. You may be in for a surprise. I don't think he will set his heathen dogs on us today. But why? Greetings, Lord of Tomberg. Ah. Uh. <laughs> That's the bastard who let the attack at Scarlet and killed my parents. Don't be an idiot. Do you want to end up like them? I am Sir Mark Vart von Aulitz. Hello. I come in the name of Sigismund of Luxembourg, King of Hungary and Croatia, who has resolved to strike against those who disrupt Concord in the land and to restore order in the name of his brother, King Wenceslaus IV. Aulitz. Restore order. By burning and pillaging the king's estates. Greetings, Sir Markvart. The efforts of the king's brother to bring order to this chaotic land are undoubtedly noble. It seems to me, though, that he and his army have somewhat strayed. As Burgrave of Prague Castle, I am entirely beholden to the king. And here in Talmberg, divine peace reigned until your arrival. To what then Drew. do we owe the honor of your visit? Drew. Yesterday, his majesty took action against the enemy of the kingdom, Sir Ratzik Kobila, who has been using the silver from the Scarlet's mine to fund insurrection against the crown. Unfortunately, the insurgent escaped. Would you happen to know, noble sir, where he might be at this time? As far as I know, the Sir Radzik of which you speak is the king's hetman at Scarlet's. I find it hard to imagine that he would rebel against our king. Nevertheless, I can assure you that Sir Radzik is not at Talberg. 
He would be a fool indeed to flee from one castle where he has little chance of defense to another where he has even less. Or do you take the view that my humble manner is any obstacle to your army? Am I to inform the king then that Zerazzi Kobila is not a Tarnberg and that he has your loyalty? Sir Radzig Kobila is not here, and I have no intentions of getting embroiled in affairs from which I have nothing to gain. Very well, sir. As you wish. I will relay your words to the king in the hope he will be as well disposed as you seem to be. Those who have clean consciences and good will may find themselves well disposed even at moments like this when there is little cause for joy. Farewell, sir. Auf Wiedersehen. <gasps> These definitely are the owls. This game is cool. It's crazy, though. Oh, see, what do you think he's telling him? Saying, get gone. The lady of the castle spoke owlish. I don't know, for Isaac, you're going to have to make a decision. My lord, you have my utmost admiration. Get on with you, Robard. I want to be a spear lord. That's a pretty big army. Do like arson and pillage, but owl is good and kind also. You can't say both of those things. Bury your loved ones in Scotlands. Talk to Sir Robard. Get a horse. Hmm? Put away my torch. Hi, Sir Robard. God be with you. How may I help? Uh, I have to go. What do you know about the Cummins? Where did these humans come from, anyway? I don't know much about them. Only what the Chamberlain said. That they came to Hungary from the east and settled there. They're godless barbarians and merciless fighters. The nobles used to say the Hungarian king shouldn't enlist them because they dishonor our rules of warfare. But when there's power and money to be had, it seems that honor isn't worth my spit. And believe me, it's always about power and money. I gotta get there. So, Robard, I need to get to Scalitz. What would you do there, lad? Sigismund might have left, but the place will be swamped with robber barons, brigands, deserters, and other vermin. Vermin? And anyway, Demon? your lord commanded you to stay here. Oh, shit. Uh... I mean, speech is my go-to, baby. My parents died there, and I won't leave them to be ravaged by dogs. I have to bury them. Good God, boy. Do you want to throw your life away for those who can never get theirs back? What if I can, uh... Do you think that's what they'd want? Forget it. Maybe, I wonder if I can end that dialogue early and then try again when I have higher uh, stats. I definitely can't do it again now. Uh, why? Why did Sigismund burn down Scalitz and then come here, too? That's war for you, lad. Certain lords have resolved to take things into their own hands and eliminate anyone who doesn't share their view. Unfortunately, Sir Radzig is one of those. And what's more, he was sitting on a pile of silver that could help King Wenceslas's allies. What happened in Gutenberg? Gutenberg? Well, I'm just a simple soldier, but the good lord gave me ears, and I've heard some things from Sir Divish and from those who fled from Sigismund's pillaging. Were there many? Indeed, but it was the Gutenberg mercenaries who came to see me, because I knew them from before. I see. Listen, lad, these are all games of the high aristocracy. In Prague, a cabal of nobles rebelled against King Wenceslas, Wealthy aristocrats who took against our king for reasons of their own. There's no doubt Sigismund had his fingers in the whole affair. Him and Wenceslas's cousin, Jobst. 
jobs. Not Cabal. Is he related Welcome to Gerb? Not the king. So then why did Sigismund attack Kuttenberg? Why do you think? Uh... For the loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. So he could loot it? Correct. Yeah. King Charles, may God grant him eternal glory, built Prague into a proper royal city, while King Wenceslas took a liking to Kutenberg. After Prague, it's the most important city in Bohemia, in the entire Holy Roman Empire. He who commands the Kutenberg silver is king. So Kuttenberg sided with Wenceslas because he favoured it. Now you're starting to understand. When Sigismund imprisoned Wenceslas and took control of Prague, the people of Kuttenberg began to raise an army against him. So with the attack on Kuttenberg, Sigismund killed two birds with one stone. He defeated Wenceslas's most powerful allies before they could stand against him and also gained immense wealth. Alrighty. Farewell. Farewell, then. Is, is it just me, or is this game, uh, neat? I learned of Jorpst. Is there just a, like an, a, like an objective menu, or do I gotta bring up my map and stuff for that? I'm pushing all the buttons to see if there are ones that I, all right. I was like 40 plus hours in and stopped playing. Uh, what's Jay do? Ah, Jay's art. Jay is my quest log. I gotta go all the way over to Jay, huh? I wonder if my F1 through F12 keys do anything cool. I already completed run. It's still a part of run. That's weird, but all right. Uh, Get out of the castle, get a horse, and bury our mans. I discovered a traitor. Uh, let's make our fortune from gambling. Frosty Hoot is the W again? No, Frosty Hoot. No, 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 no. You spent the whole night making al alchemy stuff? I bet this game was pretty cool offline. Very pretty game. I just don't, like... Like, I, I don't... I am assuming... I'm assuming... It just has the... This game has the feeling that... I mean, it's already opened up uh, significantly in terms of just the mechanics that we got to deal with and the ideas. Like, I, I have a general idea of what one can do to improve themselves. In fact, if I just look at my player, I got all these different stats here. All these skills. Not like an overwhelming amount, but for a game of this side, probably a lot. Drinking skill makes us more resistant to the nefarious effects of alcohol. I love that there's a drinking skill. I am enjoying Come Kingdom Delivery, Frosty Hoot. A rare W for you. Indeed. Alcohol. Yeah, I gotta get... The combat? It's just, like, boy, I gotta get used to that. Especially, especially since I just played Chivalry a bunch. But it, there's mounting, man. Huh? I, I, what, I, what I was getting at is that I assume the red, like the whole of the game has this level of quality. Like we're getting what we're seeing right now. We can launch pick this. And to me, this are, it just it's already just so much more than uh, than Cyberpunk. Does Cyberpunk even have like a single card game or mini game? Hello. You talk Jesus to everybody. Christ, be praised. Jesus Christ. Take care now. I wonder if we can get quests from talking to random people like that. Armor does stuff in this game. I mean, the armor is, uh, fig I think the armor is figurative as you progress through the classes, because each class has more health and they seem more armor than the last, right? That's all it does. Striking that armor does nothing, though. It just gives you more health. It's a hay house alcohol put that down twitch sensor you know dang well it's crow day hello is there someone here who trades in goods hungry are you 
Hung no, I'm not hungry. I'm Bohemia. Cook. She's good-hearted, especially if you come with some coin. I didn't ask for <laughs> food. For anything else, you should see a fellow called Votava. Folk aren't too fond of him, because he's as surly as a wet cat. Khajiit? But he can get you just about anything. I saw him by the granary. You'll recognize him easy. He looks like he's never had a decent meal in his life. All right. Well. Skidlip. I have no idea where he said he was. Can I talk to my lady? Can I take one of these horses? It's a divish's horse. That's cool looking. It's like the, it's like a cavalier horse from Age of Empires, man. Although, why is he wearing this now? I feel like that's hot. Inspect the horse. I can't believe E is the inspect button. Can I inspect his horse? No. But it's fast. Nice. You know, they all do something during the day. Which is nice. Like this man, he's shoveling his poop pile out so he can uh, take a dump later after dinner. You didn't get a greeting? What do you mean you didn't get a greeting? Hello, Twitch sensor. I've talked about you in great length today. Oh, I think this is the cabinet that I opened and I stole things from. It is. We gotta find a fence. What the? This man just woke up and got dressed. What time is it? It's, it's nine. Hi. I, I can't talk to Sir Divish. That's weird. I, it's weird. I can't I can talk to some villagers and some people don't want to talk to me. Maybe it's because they're in a private area. Maybe they don't want to talk yet. Oh, I remember the bakery's downstairs. I wonder where Milady. Oh, oh, there she is. Stephanie. Hello. The Lord save you. What do you need? Uh, I have to get the scallops. I would like to ask your assistance, my lady, if I may be so bold. Yeah. What's the matter, lad? I need to get out of the castle, and your husband is keeping me here by force. Why, for the love of God, would you want to leave the castle? She'll understand. I need to bury my parents. I wish I, I, wish I could, uh, one, two, three, four, these options. That'd my be nice. My parents are lying in the mud of scallops at the mercy of dogs and jackdaws. I can't just leave them there. That's terrible. May the Lord have mercy on their souls. But how can I help you, Henry? I don't want your death on my conscience. If I could just get past the guard at the gate somehow. But, but you can. If you wear a proper suit of armor, and if he can't see your face, he won't recognize you and he'll let you go. Good thinking. Ooh. Where? And where can I get the armor? At the armory? <laughs> Where's that? In the gate tower. But the soldiers sleep in other places around the castle too, and you might find armor nearby. It's rather embarrassing. Give me money. But if I'm to pay a bribe, I need money. And unfortunately, I don't have any. Why, if I need money? How would you? Don't worry your head about it. Dice money? This should be enough. How much? Thank you, my lady. I don't know. I will repay you, I swear. Gambling money. $25?! I've never seen that much. Oh. Well, they'll certainly ask where I'm going. You could tell them Sir Robard sent you to Ujits to ask the parish priest how the folk there are faring. That sounds reasonable. Thanks. Thank you, my lady. I must go now. How old are we? Do we even know? Do I look like a Talmberg soldier? What do you think, my lady? Do I look like a Talmberg soldier? Not quite, Henry. Just look at you. What? Oh, I see. Well, thanks. No. Goodbye. Goodbye. All right. The game's not holding. Oh, wait. No, the game is kind of holding my hand a little bit. I need to get some delicious. Delicious armor. Hey, my lord. It's weird that I can't talk to him, I guess. Somebody coming? Okay. <clears throat> Where were we? Hold. It's 
time. Easily done. Where? Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> nice. Look at us. Well, that's fancy. Hello. Good day to you. What do you need? <laughs> Farewell. Hi. My lady. My lady. God be with you. I'm sorry. Do I know you? Oh my god. <laughs> it's me, my lady. Henry. Fooled. I didn't recognize you at all. What do you I mean? I still think you should stay here in the safety of the castle, Henry. But I see your heart is drawing you away from here. God go with you. What do you mean? My lady, I hope you weren't unduly distressed by the arrival of Sigismund's army this morning. Well, it was to What be do you mean? And thanks to God's mercy and my good husband, there was no more bloodshed. But it's something... You know, maybe she needs glasses. Me. Maybe my mind deceives me. But I have an evil foreboding. You, my lady? Surely not. No evil could possibly come to you. You know, I fear something bigger and worse will come. That Sigismund is only another omen of imminent evil. Of great evil. You know, I never really, uh, I never, that's something I, I think about sometimes and I never research. When did, when did they make glasses? What did they do with poor eye? What did people with poor eyesight do back in the day? They just die? Like, what? Well, guess I'm, I'm lame then. I could mount and steal. Maybe they would let me do it because I'm a I'm a village. Glasses were invented during the medieval era. How? How did how? <laughs> I need to look into that. Sounds interesting. Where's the gate? I mean, I could just I could just go down here and leave. I think. Ravna. I can just fast travel there? Excuse me. The facial recognition is worse than Box and L.A. Noir. Shut up, Twitch sensor. Hi. My respects to you. My respects. We don't need to talk to this man. I don't know where, the, where are them traitors at. Does it, do they pop up on the map? Here in Townburg? They do. The combat arena. This is right here. And we have two popes. This one? Oops. I'm looking at the coming screen. Ah. Hey. Did he's get it seems like a bad idea to talk to him in this outfit. Okay. Why am I back? There's no one, there's no one here with which to do combat. <laughs> Farming is a useless profession. We can always come and take shelter here at the Cook item. Anyway, you said yourself Eat from you pot. Well, don't mind if I do. Thanks for the free grub. No buts. Everything will be all right. Medieval scum. Hello. Say? Just find your own mouses. You don't farm mice. 
Hello. God be with you. I need to go. I need to get out of here. Says who? I've never seen you before in my life. And that's odd, seeing as how you're wearing our colors. Uh, go. I mean, I could speech him, but Captain Robard sent me to Uzitz. I'm Sir Robard's messenger. He's sending me to Uzitz to find out if Sigismund's army has been giving them trouble. I might believe you if I knew who you were. Who the hell are you? Uh, you know who I am. I'm Janik of Malish. I'm Yannick of Malishov. I haven't been here long, but if you had your eyes open, you would have noticed me. Now open the fucking gate, or I'll have to Whoa. go and get some robard, and you wouldn't want that, would you? Oh, all right, all right. God be with you. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye. Good date. Flee the castle. Hello. Ooh. We're out. We outy boys. I gotta find a horse though. So it can be fat. Speaking of fat, I'm a pig. <laughs> and I'm wearing stolen clothes. And I have a lot of stolen items. Somewhere. Do they become not stolen after a time? Because I did steal all of this. And it doesn't have the red hand on it anymore. And I still have Sir Radzig's sword. Why would I ever use another sword than this? Because this, if this is supposedly the best sword he's ever made, and my father's a master blacksmith. My buff isn't overeating. You're supposed to steal one from the castle? What, a sword? Maybe it's a ceremonial sword? I mean, they kept talking about how good it would be in battle. I don't know, man. Uh, don't, do I have a, um... Levels derived from your stats and your progress through the game is useful for comparing your character to that of your friends. With every second level you reach, you can select one perk that will allow you to make your character more specialized. Oh, jeez! So I'm at level three right now. I have one perk that I can spend with my main level. And I get perks. You get strength perks at every other level up. I did not know that it was this in depth. <laughs> Sheesh. A manly odor. You'll have 50% more charisma when talking to women. However, people will smell you a mile off, reducing your stealth skill by 30%. What do you mean? Sheesh. Increases the sight distance of fast travel. I don't want debuffs. Penalties on stats following release from jail. 20% level. Look at all these. Uh, you grew in an impoverished. You grew up in impoverished conditions, so comfort of beds is inverted for you. The worse the bed, the better you sleep. And vice versa. What? That's weird. I feel like I don't want that. I feel like I don't want any of these. Maybe the manly odor. Because I do want to... I don't want any of those. <laughs> they all do something bad. All of them are trade-offs. No. This, this, one's, this one's just good. Increases the sight distance of fast travel, so you notice events on the way sooner, and your chances of evading are also increased by 10%. That is good all the way. What about this? Gravedigger. Carrying dead or unconscious bodies won't cost you any stamina, and they will burn you only half as much. Ooh. Blocking an opponent's strike with your shield will cost you 30% less stamina. Well, that sounds nice. I don't have a shield, though. I should probably keep these. I don't have any, uh, charisma. My speech! When I try to lose patience, you get one more chance to make another offer. 
Increases your speech level by plus three when talking to nobles and wealthy per people. You can't have the lowborn perk simultaneously. Oh, interesting. Man. Why wouldn't you want the poor man's sleepings? Because what? what I don't... I, I don't know, dog. Maybe I'm going to be really, really rich when I grow up, Sivvy. And then what? And then I'll be sleeping in these... And then I'll be sleeping on the dirt. And these nobles will be laughing at me. And then they'll be like, why can't you get a good sleep in our fancy big old beds? And I'll be like, listen, homie. Oh, my God. Even these have... Oh, my God. Even these have extra things? I can pickpocket? Dog. We're going to be so degenerate. You don't even know, chat. I would not want... What do you, what do you mean, Frosty Toot? You don't like, you don't like the poppers. I'm going the wrong way. Do you think alcoholism has perk points too? It does. Look. Wait. <laughs> Look at this. Wine bibber drunk, loose tongue. True Slav Bacchus. <laughs> I do need a horse. I can't steal one from in there. I might be able to get one from the town. But also, also, you know what? I might be able to get one from the burnt village. That's a little far, though. True slab, fast dude. Boom, boom, boom. Do, do, do. I think it'll be a horse over here, though. I want, I want a perk to allow me to run more. I wonder how I can, I can increase my agility. I actually don't know. I guess strength from like fighting it might tell me. Wait. Measure of speed. Uh, not only moves faster, but better at evading strikes. You can skillfully wield more sophisticated weapons, more skilled at archery. You get agility perk points at every fourth level up. Right. How do I... Uh, do I just have to do those things? I just have to try to evade and arch? Like this one. Running, surmounting obstacles, and surviving combat enhance vitality. And just speaking well will increase that. And I do need to be stronger. Green lush fields. You sure do, dog. Dog? Hello? playing. Hi. She's a trainer. Some people can teach you. For some lessons, you'll have to know something already, though. There might be more than one trainer for each skill, but there's always four lessons. He trains in lock picking? Here you're able to open locks without a key. Will you teach me how? Certainly. Uh, beginner. Uh, I'm interested in more advanced techniques. Wouldn't you rather learn the basics first? All right. I'd like to practice the basics. All right. But it'll cost you. Well, how much? <gasps> 60 bucks? Isn't that quite a lot? I don't need your help. Sorry, but I'm not going to teach you for that price. How about I just pick your lock, bitch? What do you want? No business here. Fine. Where'd your dog go? Well, there he is. The hell does he eat? Hip. What kind of dog is he? Is that this poop? Are you quite well? 
Sage. My God. I have to shut. I have to close shut the jaws of oblivion and save the day. There's another town, another little village, like right here. I need a mortar and pestle. He's a criminal. Ah! Oh God! Ow! Does my health regenerate over time? I sure hope it does. What if I can sleep on the road? Poppy. Those aren't even big jumps, yo. Any horses? Hello? Hip. Don't break your legs. I feel like breaking your legs is a death sentence. I discovered a camp. These must be survivors. I'm sorry. What? What's happening? Looks like they've already gone. Where am I? Why am I at Scallets? I I was so far away from Scallets. so far away oh come on it's okay it was an optional objective what where am I on the map no I'm in Ro I'm in Rovna all right but I I I went here I went into this camp and that's what teleported me to Rovna so I was here and now I'm here why? But why? What's my, uh, what's this thing that's building up right now? I have injured legs. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God, I can loot them. Nice. Bread and shrooms. It's not very fresh. I literally wanted to find a horse and get there. I wanted to explore on my way, Frosty 2. That is not RPG. I found a horse. Are my feet injuries going up as I'm walking on them? What's going on there? Oh no. It's a bad man. Somehow he doesn't see me. What are you doing here? Okay, didn't work. Of life, are you? Bitch! I'm getting my sword out. We're slashing, we're stabbing, and we're blocking sometimes, but probably not. All right, I'm changing. I'm changing the block from Q, though. Oh, yeah. Cause that just won't do. Boom. Boom. 
Come on, you shit. <laughs> we gonna do about a bitch. <laughs> Little bitch. Most people don't want to die, so they may surrender to you. It's up to you what you want to do with them. I'm talking to him. Uh, let him go disarmed. Continue combat in dialogue. What do I do, chat? One to let him go. Three or two to kill. Two or three to kill, sure. One to set him free. Two to feed. I've seen a lot more ones than I thought I would. But at the end of the day, Oh, never mind. Well, my job is done. Okay. I don't know why this happened. Oh, I took something on accident. I mean to. I guess he bled out. Yeah. That's neat. A seeks. Stay there. Literally every single person watching did say let him go and I killed him. I didn't kill him. He died on his own. He should have just not died instead. My main hand. It's got a little red symbol on it. It means it's bloody. Wait, where's my weapon? Where's my Radix sword? What? Where's my sword? Oh, it's in the quest item. Okay. What's the red mean? That it is bloodied? I think so. Can I clean it? Okay. Damage. Condition. Oh yeah, Sir Radic Sword's Omega good. We probably don't want to uh, damage it too much though. I feel like we're going to eventually give it to somebody. Alright. Goodbye, Bandit Chan. Bitch. Now, what was he looking for? Ooh, a pretzel. Eat mine. What's the red mean? It's no good? I don't want food poisoning, all right? I know all about that. Nice. Bum ba da doo. Ba da dee da. No horse, by the way. Why did it? I still want to know why I got teleported. Was that a bug? It had to have been. There's, unless there was like something they didn't want me to see yet on the way there. Unless they really thought I didn't want to explore on my way there, which is I don't. I can't imagine that's the case. Uh, my health is still at eighty. It has not gone up. Probably need a rest to heal or something. You think you got teleported too? That's a, that's a weird decision. I feel like I'm playing the Elder Scrolls though. Look at the little indicator at the bottom. My leg's unbreaking? Is it unbreaking? 
I haven't I don't I haven't noticed the bar moving. We're almost there actually. I, 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 it's hard for me to believe that in a game like this, they would do that. But again, I feel like this is still kind of tutorial. I don't know why it's telling me about drawing weapons right now. I remember the making of videos leading up to the release of this game. People were hyped. Well, no. What the? Who's this? Crawling out under some rock. You asked for it. Ow! Dude, I don't know how to parry. Or, like, how to not die immediately. What the fuck is happening? I guess I'm just going to die, because I don't know what the fuck is happening. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, yeah, definitely going to die. All right, there's, there's literally nothing I can do right now. God, this is such... How do I let fucking let go? God damn! Fucking Jesus Christ! Literal fucking trash goddamn gameplay, dog. Holy fuck, that's awful. Jesus Christ. God, it feels so bad. I'm back here now. God, I want to get into... As, I'm so glad I've specced into speech, because I want to do that as little as possible. Oh my god. I don't even care that, like, th those guys look like real soldiers. They would, they should absolutely destroy me. It's not about, like, not being able to beat them, you dumbass. It's about the game feeling like trash. Fucking following them around, locking on. I got all these different directions. I, I don't know what my character is doing. I can't see his arms swinging around. Hello. I can fuck this guy up. What's up, dog? I don't know what the fuck's happening now. I was doing well against this guy before. You'll get what for? Do I have to block in the right direction too? I don't even know. Let's find out. Please swing. No, I don't think so. Oh, oh, oh. Well, I guess I killed him for real this time. <laughs> Did not teach you the combat yet? No, you had like, you were taught how to swing. You weren't even taught how to block in the beginning. Like maybe there was someone I could have talked to at, at the town before about combat, maybe. Um... The dude in the beginning teaches you how to how to swing your sword. Can I sleep here? Oh, I can't. All right, this might this might heal us a little bit. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Literally, I have time to lose. I'm going to go save some dead people. It's not that big of a deal. I mean, again, unless unless there was something else I could have done. That is what they've taught me. Why does this game sell soap? I don't know. <laughs> Do you want to buy some? If your dirty NPCs act, react to you differently? Yeah. We, we can even unlock a skill, Ian, that makes women like us more if we are dirty. Uh, but it makes us easier to detect in stealth. I know there's Kingdom Come branded soap. Uh, come soap. Kingdom Come soap. Excuse me. Oh, you must be a farm boy. You've got poop all over you. That's so sexy. Who buys branded video game soap? I mean...
hides Fortnite brand. So, uh, not me, dog. Da, 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 do that. I don't even know who these soldiers are out here, but I guess they're just, just brigands. I'm going to avoid them this time. You know what I'm going to do? Block, right click, secondary attack. It's my, it's, I'm, I'm, that's my stab button in, in uh, chivalry. There we go. Much better. Were they called bandits? Ooh. Nice. If you sell Splatoon soap in the shape of squid girls. No squid girls allowed. Cabbage. Mine now. Why does this basket make that make make a jar sound like that? That's dark. I'm looting my friends and taking their bread. Nice. Wait, she got the same hair as Lady Stephanie. Nice. Money! I got to choose how much I wanted to take out of one coin. Oh yeah, they, the people also make the, that sound. I can't get in. Let me in, homie. Why would you do this? Just mount it. Ah! What? Let's go over the bush. There must be a way. You bought a Batman doll shampoo bottle? Oh, jeez. I talked about this before, but they, uh, at once upon a time, sold, uh, Hulk green Hershey's, uh, chocolate syrup. Box 94 soap win. Um, see, my brand of soap, it'll be unique because I will have rubbed every bar on my, uh, yeah. on my body. I feel like I'm not doing this correctly. Hmm. This gate is blocked off. Actually, no, the other way into the city would be, like, through the castle over here. Or, I guess, through that gate, potentially. It'll be alright, probably, going this way. This is this is the way we would have escaped, actually. Not necessarily from this. Let's just go down this mountainside. You would buy a box of 94 bath water. It wouldn't be bath water for me. It'd be shower water. I don't like baths. Oh, God. I thought I was going to get stuck. The merch link is broken. No, Ian. I replaced the merch link, the merch link with uh, exclamation point Sudoku. So I could sell my Box 94 branded Sudoku pages. Yes. The merch ring. Yes. Ha <laughs> ha. Get a wrecked twitch sensor. This was Theresa's house. I hope she made it out alive. I wonder if her body would be in here if we didn't save her. She is our future love interest. Unbanned Twitch sensor now. No. He knows what he did.
Hot tub boxes and bath machines. Wait. Man, I wish I had a horse. I wonder where I could have e easily gotten one. I was looking for one before it shot me halfway across the map. Dog? <laughs> Hello? Also, I feel like being in all this rain is going to make us sick. I feel like... I feel like we can catch a cold in this game. I could have stolen one from the castle? In front of everybody? Yeah, I know I could have stolen one from there. I didn't want to do that. I felt like that was dumb. I wanted to take one outside of the castle. I assumed it'd be much easier to steal one from one of the little uh, neighboring villages outside of the courtyard of the lord of the castle. Is there wildlife in this game? Absolutely. I know there's deer. Uh, probably in the thicket. You can definitely hunt. In fact, there is pretty sure uh, there's hunting. There's a hunting skill. There's a, it looks like there's a whole bunch of animals. You can uh, hunt game and poultry. <laughs> Birds. Maybe fish? That'd be cool if you could fish. I don't know if you can fish. Uh, looks like you can You can even skin and, and butcher animals. Oh my god, this is blocked off too. Bro. Bruh. I guess we got to go around to this gate then. Can I put down a uh, marker? I can. Hopefully that one has room. All right. I like hunting fish with dynamite. Steak tartar. Hey, I got a new level of vitality. This is like Morrowind, just jumping. Oblivion, just got... Okay, I am stuck, though. Just jumping for skill points. Game doesn't really like you mountaineering very much. Hip. Oh, God. Oh, God. There we go. The money saved on that E3 conference. I, why even bother? I don't know how much money that cost them, but why bother paying anything for what they showed off? <laughs> same with uh, with Capcom. Same with Cock Media. Blah, blah. I'm in the I'm in the brambles. <laughs> Thank you, Ian. Who is Cock Media? What the fuck? Oh, yeah, it's another door. Okay. Uh, actually, I saw War uh, War Horse. I thought this studio retweeting some of their stuff. I don't know what they do, but they do something with video games. But you wouldn't know it from their E3 conference. I think he apps with three P's, Ian. FYI. Hello. Ooh. Ah! Man, I tried every door except the one that worked. True, we are cowards. <gasps> Money! Actually looting the dead. Jeez! Not Billy! Dog? Damn it. Clear that marker. Taking the money while leaving the carrot. I have so much food in my pocket, Ian, and it goes bad, so I gotta not take as much food as I am. This is a waste. Dried meat, on the other hand, and salami, and salt, and money. Nine dollars on this man. You know, maybe the burning of our town wasn't so bad.
I hear this barking dog, but I don't know if it's real. I want to save dog meat if I can. It may be a figment of my uh, imagination. It would be a waste. You know, some vulture is going to come down, you know. Start pecking away at him. He's gonna have a nice. He's gonna have a nice little uh, little surprise in his pocket. You know, a well-rounded meal for the birds. He stood by his side and he did this to you. Oh, the dude. You were a hero. You didn't run away. In the band, right now. Vultures weren't invented yet. True. Gotta look for money. And only money. No. No, my boy. Where's the drunk man? Bianca! No! It wasn't supposed to be you, Bianca. I'll find the bastards that did this to you. No! I'll find them. I swear it. Just wait a moment. I'll take care of my parents, and then I'll come back for you. I'll Bianca! You like this. I'll take this as a keepsake to remember you by. Was that your love interest? Yeah, in the very beginning of the game. We were going to give her a surprise in the evening, and now we'll never know what that was. Uh oh. Can I wear it? Nice. We can sell it, too. For money. <laughs> surprise! It's a raid. A raid Shadow Legends. Cutscene. <laughs> now we're back in, uh, in the other town. Mom, Papa. Why did he do it to me, Father? Why? Why did you leave me? Forgive me. Do I have the gravekeeper perk? No. Forgive me for everything. Next time I won't run. I'll never run away again. I'll absolutely do that. I'll find the one who did this to you. I remember his face. I'll find him. We never did help mom with that one thing she wanted us to help with. But first, I have to find the shovel and take care of you. Gotta bury them under the I tree. You told me you wanted to lie beside mother. Here. Under the linden tree. At least I can do that much for you. Crying, bro. Do I have to find a shovel? Yes. Loot. Nice. Papa. <gasps> Money.
I have to find a spade. Where is this dog? Is he real? Hello? Is there an elephant in there too? No way. I don't think they're real. I think they're I think they're messing with me. Also, I'm stuck. Okay. Hello? I'm really surprised there aren't any badmans in here. Oh, there is a dog. Get away, you must. Get away, you beast! What's going on? It's Bishak. What in God's name are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? Digging turnips? The beast just went for me. Isn't that Mutt the Butcher's? No. Uh, Isn't that Body the Butcher's? Yeah, that's him. What's that got to do with anything? Hello. <laughs> He's protecting his master. I'd say the poor creature is standing guard over his master. You weren't trying to get to him, were you? What do you care what I'm doing? What are you doing? Uh, I want to bury my parents. Came to bury my parents. So bury them and leave me be. No. What happened to the Risa? Do you know what happened to Teresa from the mill? When I fled, the humans wanted to... They meant to violate her, and God knows what else. No, I don't know. What do I care? They probably raped her and killed her like all the others. Her misfortune... I know I didn't like I that, Zibashek. Uh... <laughs> Fuck you! Uh, give me that. Would you lend me that spade? I have to dig a grave. I can't find another. What's it worth to you? I see you have a fine sword. I'll gladly trade you my spade for that. How did you come by it, anyway? Uh, it's for Sir Radzig. My father. I don't think we're strong enough Radzig. to intimidate him. I think it's a trap. It's my duty to deliver it to him. It's not for sale. Go right ahead and dig that grave. See how that is. And where will you dig it anyway? Here? You're not going to lay your parents in unhallowed ground, are you? Uh, no. Father said he wanted to be buried here, and I can't take him to St. James's. God willing, later I can find a priest to consecrate the ground. How'd you get away? How did you manage to get away? How do you think I ran? Hey. I've interrupted you robbing the dead. Is that why you're so ill-tempered? You bastard. Haven't you got a shred of honor? And what of it? The butcher has no more need of corn. And now that I think of it, your sword would do me quite nice. What, are you going to well. attack me with a shovel? Will you hand it over without a fuss, or do you want to end up like the butcher here? The only way you'll touch this sword is when I shove it in your guts. So that's the way of it. What? Oh yeah, dog! I'm coming, bitch! What? Apply it to the apple. What did I just do? <laughs> what did I just do? <laughs> did I drop it? Did I... Can I... What did I just do? The fuck? Okay. That might make it fresh. Alright, I save. You bitch! Oh, goddammit! You! 
It, it stopped me from going outside. <laughs> Hold on a second. That's the most recent one. Boom. Hold on a second. We gotta be fast, boys. I cannot attack. It would not work. It wouldn't do it, chat. God, it won't do it. Is there a tackle button on him? I don't think it's letting me do it. There's an X over him. I don't think I can do it. I think they're legitimately making him uh Yeah, you can't do it. You can't attack him. Nope. They're making him come back later in the story. For sure. Did I get the shovel? I don't know. Hello, puppy. Easy there, boy. You know me. Your good master won't be needing this anymore. <laughs> he doesn't have anything. Sorry, puppy dog. Boom, ba doo doo da doo da da dee. I'm gonna bury you too, my lady. That's what we said to do. We're gonna do anyway. I'm looting the dead too. No. Bring the dog. It's what I wanted to do. Eat the bread. Oh, we're omega fat. Ugh. Nice. Linden tree. I never rob. I'm not a hypocrite. This is a good place. You're gonna like it. I got to equip the shovel. Is that a weapon? No. It's a quest item. Can't uh, equip it though. Oh, here we go. Grave dug. Oh boy. Give him one of our pretzels. Yep, that's a boy, all right. So. Let's get to it. Are we putting both of our parents in the same hole? can't pick he can't pick his mom up I didn't put any points in strength how am I gonna do this do you need some help is that him yes can't you see the sword 
God damn it. That's why we couldn't kill him. What do you want? Spishek? Who do you think we are? Franciscan brothers? <laughs> We're here to rob you of everything you've got. Especially that fine blade that's of no use to a peasant like you anyway. Banish the thought. It is my father's sword. You mean him? I don't think he's going to be needing it anymore. Listen here, boy. You hand over that sword. I might just let you go. I don't want to get bonked. If not, you're in for a family reunion you really don't want. Leave me alone. Kill him, runt. I cut the bastard down. As you like. Could have just cost you a few teeth. Ah! Thud. Very well. We do battle. Topsy Dilly! What? That's gonna cost you your life. What is yeah. happening? Ooh! I definitely blocked it, but it still did some damage. D, what the fuck? It just straight up does damage to me. Can I? Can we win that? I feel like you can't because it does. Told you how it would end. Does damage no matter what. This is nice work. The chief is going to like it. You definitely can't win that. It's new, isn't it? We gotta go get the sword back. And now, for the maiden bloodletting. Surely your father never would have imagined it would be your blood. I've killed a man before. I believe there's a word for such moments. The old man would certainly know. Well, I'm just a common killer. Did you help make it? No doubt you did. Such miserable luck. To die by the sword you helped forge. Hey, go fuckers! Dab? <laughs> well, who would have been there if we didn't save Teresa? The games are over. They took my sword. So you're supposed to lose that fight, dog. Jeez. I lost my sword. Oh my god. <laughs> They're gonna title drop us. I'm four hours into the game. <laughs> My parents. All right, they got buried. Dan Brown's that guy, not the other dude. Brian Blessed. What a name. This is medieval Red Dead right now. <laughs> Blessed. Yo, Brian, do be blessed right now. If 
the game starting again? No, it's just now beginning. hours? Four. But I've been messing around a little bit. Red. What the? They didn't title drop us. This is how I see everyday life. I'm getting skills by doing this. Great. Don't worry, I'll save you, Mama. Yeah. I don't know how to grapple like that. <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to be here. I have a sword too. Ah! I'll save you. Ow. Ow. I will destroy my dream cummins. Alright, I'm leaving. I'm going towards the objective, sir. I wonder if I could just farm infinite short sword by doing that. Hello. Do you need some help? Just stab him. You know? Ah! Prince Baldrick. The egg army comes. I think I have an infection. Wake up, Henry. It's past all right. Henry, can you hear me? Get up, Henry. Wake up. Opa. It's a new day. Henry, can you hear me? My love. Hallelujah. I thought you'd never wake. Will you have yes, I have life? malaria. It took me out of my clothes. Hmm. You still have a fever. Uncle won't be pleased, but you'll have to stay in bed. I am sick. Where am I? In Scalitz? We're at my uncle's mill in Retay. I didn't know where else to go. What happened? You don't remember anything? I suppose that's not surprising. I found you in Scalitz after those bandits attacked you. I thought they'd done for you. But you were still breathing. Why in heaven's name did you go back there? It was madness. They slaughtered everyone who didn't run. My parents, I... I wanted to bury them. I had to... Don't worry. I took care of it. Thank you. Any good Christian would have done the same. Now sleep. You need your strength back. <sighs> A few delirious days later. Hi. Good morning. <laughs> it's near midnight. 
You've slept all day. Oh. <laughs> oh, I feel like a horse fell on me. The beating you took was worse. But at least the fever's broken. <laughs> and now, five days later, we're going to ask some questions. How did you find me? How did you manage to save me? You were lucky. I was in Scalitz and I saw Zbyshek and his thugs. I tried to distract them, but it would have been no use if those soldiers from Tamburg hadn't arrived. They were searching for you and scattered the bandits. So it was by chance that they were there. She was this, So she was just standing stoically in the distance, hoping that was going to be enough. What in the world were you doing in Scalitz? Waiting to die. What? They killed my brothers, my family, my friends. They're all dead. All of them. Everyone I ever loved. They killed one of my brothers in the mines. Oh no, bro. After that, what did I have to live for? Don't say that. There's always hope. No, there isn't. But it doesn't matter. I'm a different person now. Searching for me? Yes. Lord Divish sent them, led by Captain Robard. So tell me, why is a lord of such high standing interested in a blacksmith? So Divish promised Sir Radzik he'd look after me. But as for why they should care, I've no idea. I am tired. Oh, I'm exhausted. I'm not surprised. I'll bring you water and something to eat. In the meantime, rest. You're still very weak. And even later. <laughs> good morning to you. Hi. How's the invalid today? Whoa! Ugh, I haven't felt as good as this since they lashed me to the wheel. I'm not an invalid. The town square. Got your sense of humor back. You must be better. My uncle will be glad to hear it. I had a job this very to let game. me bring you here. If you'd lain around much longer, he really would have dumped you on the town square. You can stay until you find somewhere else to live. But my uncle will want payment for taking you in and caring for you. Shut up, Twitson, sir. And this is your uncle's house? We're in Rete Mill. My uncle's Miller Peshek. He took me in, and I talked him into taking care of you, too. I've been lying. I've been lying here long enough. Uncle will be pleased he's one mouth less to feed. But are you truly well enough? Well enough to do what has to be done. Where can I find Sir Radzig? He's in the Lower Castle in Perkstein. He's a guest of Sir Hanish of Lipa. But someone like you can't just walk up bold as you please and demand an audience. I know, Sir Radzig. And I didn't bring him his sword as I was supposed to. I must see him. If you insist. But you need to speak to my uncle first. You've I want to try the archery in this game. You've been for over a fortnight while he paid the apothecary to tend to you. Did she and just say? for medicine. That's a good deal of a coin you owe him. I've been lying here two weeks. My God. Better a fortnight in bed than an eternity she, in the grave. She said it again? If it weren't for my uncle, you wouldn't be here at all. I owe you my wife. I owe you both my life. And I'll repay my debt. You have my word. All right. But before you go to town, you should eat something. You're still weak. There's food on the table for you. I don't get a crosshair? Good. Don't need one. I am very powerful. Rate Mill is my new home. I can sleep here and save the game. You have your own common trunk, which is available to you in all your homes and rented lodgings. Damn. It, it didn't actually title drop me, though, did it? Oh, <gasps> My stuff. Ancient map. Is that DLC stuff? I don't know why I have DLC. All my things. Being able to read was a very rare skill in the Middle Ages, and a common blacksmith's son certainly wouldn't have been literate. To understand written text, you will have to find someone who can teach you to read. Neat. I have no idea, Quinzel. I'm also still not, uh, oh wait, I am 100 health. Okay, never mind. But I am hungry. I learned language and literature. Well, that was easy. I learned books. I learned books. Hmm. 
So the, the over time, the stolen goods just become yours. The mail collar goes down one. What? But I do make a lot of noise. I also become conspicuous. I have a ton of stuff on me. Time to eat, yo. Time to eat just a ton of things. Mm. And now I'm fat. Oh, there's a pot here, too. Nice. I know books now. Books are pog. Damn. Ah! Ah! I gotta pick this lock. Trying to get a good look on her. Robbing from a cobweb. The essential material of a spider's dwellings and of certain magic potions? Whoa. Bludgeon. I could just get a straight up stick. <laughs> I just want to get that lock picking experience. Drink the web. Drink the cobweb. Consume the bludgeon. Supposed to be very easy, dog. Nice. Scoop. Ooh. I will take the stick. You didn't know magic was in this game? I think it's, uh, I don't think it will be actual magic. Stolen in God knows where? What? What does that mean? <laughs> wow, I am far away. I'm at like the, I'm actually at the other side of the map right now. Jeez. DLC quest. I have a stick now. Bonk. Beep. In case anyone needs a good bonking. Word with you, young fellow. Hey. hey, youngster! I'm Henry. My name's Henry. Thank you for taking care of me here. My name's Peshek, and I'm the miller here. You've already met my niece, Teresa. Theresa. She took care of you for two whole weeks while you were in limbo. And talking of you being at death's door, while you were lying here, you worked up quite a bill with the blood letter. Who came now and again to keep you alive with his potions? That quack doesn't come cheap. I paid him what I could, but I still, that is, you still owe him. I see. Well, it's better to be in debt than to lie dead in a ditch. What do I owe? I'm not afraid of hard work. You won't pay for that shoveling manure. I might have a better job for you. And it's not something any fool can do. I'm a fool. If you prove to me you're a clever lad, I might trust you with something you could really make money from. What do you say? I can do that. Well, what would you need from me? A trifle. Just to take something from someone and bring it to someone else. And not get caught while you're doing it. That sounds straightforward enough. Except for not get caught. Why would anyone want to catch me? Oh, don't worry. It's just a job like any other. Nice. Only this one requires, uh, let's say, the right moral disposition. Do corpses bother you? No honorable man should touch them. That's the executioner's job. Did you expect I'd give you a hoe and send you out to the fields? Nice. You could dig all right, but somewhere else. 
I want to know whether you're going to hide behind some stupid fucking scruples, or if you might be useful for more unconventional work. Do. I was prepared I for will just do. about anything, but that's a bit much. But go on. Tell me more. Listen, it's about this ring my mate, Wojciech, the Kohelnitz Miller, had his eye on. Trouble is, they buried the ring by the gibbet, along with the villain they hung while he was wearing it. Jesus Christ. You want me to dig up a corpse, nice. take a ring from it, and mm -hmm. give it to your friend in Kohelnitz? There's nothing sacred to you. Money first, morals later. That fellow is dead. He won't miss it. Whatever bleeding heart came up with the idea that it's disrespectful to disturb a corpse never read the Bible. It's still a human body, only it's missing a soul. Why be disgusted by something created by God? Yeah, all right. I think I've already heard more than I need to know. You've got the tongue of the devil himself. If you tried hard enough, I bet you could justify sodomy with a goat. Ooh. Watch your mouth, boy. There's a shovel here around the mill somewhere. If there's any problem, come and see me. And here's something on the side to make you dig better. Thanks. I'll need it. I can't believe I've come to this. So I stayed rent-free in his courses. house, and now he's oh, giving and, me uh, money. Watch out for the executioner and his hounds. They're pretty savage. And I don't just mean the dogs. You can just throw them some meat. The dogs, that is. But the executioner? Well, don't vex him. May the Lord watch over you. I can distract dogs with meat? Well, oh, he gave me spirits. I have to get a spade. <laughs> Treasures of the Past DLC. I don't know how I have DLC. It must have been free or something. Because I certainly only bought this on launch and nothing else. I didn't even hesitate. Hell yeah, dog. Grave robbing. Let's do it. It ain't a cock ring, chat. Come now. Look, if I'm delivering cum, I gotta get my hands a little dirty. You know what I'm saying? A legend is circling in the province about stashes containing magnificent war horse armor. Many people have searched for it, but in vain. With a little effort and the grace of God, perhaps you can succeed in finding the armor and donning it to assist you in fighting the good fight. The first part of the warhouse armor and five treasure maps will appear in your universal trunk after launching the main quest Awakening in Ratty Mill. You can access your trunk from any home or lodging you have in the world. Tournament! The tournament conceived or er, convened by Sir Hanush takes place once every seven days at Ratty Upper Castle. The aim of the tourney is to test the skills of combatants will all kinds of weapons. It's intended for commoners, so you you can enroll too. After completing the side quest next to Godliness with Sir Hands, you can accept a new quest room, which will launch in an instance of the regular tournament. If you're not sure where to find them, look for the gun icon. If you've already progressed in the storyline as far as epilogue, you won't be able to accept the quest from Cat Capcom, and the tournament will launch on its own. All right, it's telling me a lot right now. When the first DLC was horse armor. You ever heard of expansions? I bet you I can find some horse armor in World of Warcraft, dog. I can't lockpick that. Also, horse armor was the best decision ever made. Can I sit next to her and talk to her? Have you eaten yet? Yes. Yes, it was very good. Yes, it was very good. Did you bake it yourself? I did. I'm glad you enjoyed it. You look like something the cat dragged in. Oh. Fancy a little walk? What are you up to? How would you like to, um, I don't know, uh, come for a walk? A walk? I'd like that very much, but I can't right now, Hal. Give me some time to settle in, will you? If that's what you want. It's not you, Hal. Oh it's shit, I forgot about time. fridge duty. Bonker Conga. Get on fridge duty, thank you very much. Scoop! 
Well, I better get hit the old dusty trail. I've been rejected, bro. Hip. I, I am curious to see what the HD te textures do. I'm also curious what uh, performance hit they have. Why can't Streamlabs do Box 94R? Uh, because they're not subbed to me. What do you mean, homie? They used to be. That's why they used to be able to do it. But then they stopped their subscription. Did they wipe in medieval times? That's pretty sus, yeah. <laughs> Can I have that? Uh, where's this hatchet, son? Go to Perkenstein. Get the dead man's ring for Miller uh, Peshek. Quest giver. Boy, quest giver. Did I lose my spade from the uh, from the earlier? I did. <laughs> it does look very colorful. It's a great looking game. Genuinely, it's a good-looking game. I think the water looks really good. I think that's uh, one of the surprising things. The reflection on the water looks really good. The rain looks good. Uh, I mean, I don't know anything about the game after this point, obviously, but uh, I say that these guys did a pretty good job for being a little old studio. No, that's just not... That's just not fair for old box 94A. That looks all right. You have to try those. I'll try those HD. I, I assume the HD textures are a free download. <laughs> Cave mushroom. I wonder what very hard makes it. I wonder if it makes it a smaller sweet spot, which would be tough. Red sheepskin. It was red. There's just something new. It'll come in handy when the weather gets cold. Can I wear it? Let's take one. Let's try to put some stuff away. I'm very, very thick right now. I can't wear it, but I, uh... Can probably craft something with it. I have a lot of things to sell as well. Oops. Because I stole a lot of things from the... I steal things from people that save me, typically. Uh, like the Venetian glass chalice. And the decorated goblets. Somehow the decorated silver goblets more than the Venetian white glass. Surprised by that. I guess silver's pretty expensive. Yeah, Twitch Center, the uh, the chest that's in my room is a universal storage across all of my houses. Of which I only have one right now, which is that one. I gotta find this. this the spade's probably a lot closer than I, I think it is. So I'll probably... Uh, stick it in over here. A scythe? Oh, I want that! I want to be a peasant warrior. That trouble? What? Anytime you crouch and you move around, people think that you're up to no good. 
And usually I am. But I'm just trying to get under things, you know. I'm going to store these ancient maps for now. Not really after that. Uh... I will carry the bludgeon. What, is it, what does the black mean? That it's dirty? It must mean that it's dirty. Right? Maybe? Do I need to launder my clothes? Uh... I don't know, store that. Store that. I'm not wearing it. Marigold. Grows where the earth is fertile on rubble piles and dung and abundantly too in pastures. Oh, that's right. It's just a flower. Store that. Uh, store that. Store that. Salami. Keep that. Very important. Got my seeks. I'm glad I grabbed some other weapons. Oh, the chalice is, uh... Ah, yeah, I'll store it, sure. Goblet. Decorated goblet. A little bit more room. Some cheese I gotta eat. Hoarding like a crow. It's good to hoard things. I wonder if that bread roll will, uh... rot over time being set out like that. Probably not. I don't know where this, uh, where his shovel is. Set it somewhere in the mill. He could, he could just tell me. That would be very helpful. Maybe I can get some, get one somewhere else. I don't see a big old pile of manure somewhere. How's this door sitting? Can't get in there. Boom, 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 boom. It's just a side quest anyway. Oh, there it is. Spade. I really shouldn't be wearing the super heavy armor. It was not really that heavy. But there's literally no use for it, because if I get into a fight against anyone that knows what they're doing, I'm dead anyway. So it's really just slowing me down. I shouldn't be wearing, uh... Probably anything. Oops. I don't know what buttons I'm pushing. I think I'm going the right way. No Aluko sipping. Do not owl sip. Hello, townsman. My respects to you. Hello. Tell me about Ratty. Oh my. How is Hanush? Have you heard anything about the Cummins? Have you heard anything about the Cummins in Sigismund's army? Everywhere they go, they pillage, rape, and slaughter. Or so the tales have it. Of course, all armies do that. But them barbarians take pleasure in it. How's Hanush? What kind of governor is Sir Hanush? He's strict but just. Thank God for him. He don't get mixed up in nothing like that Sir Radzik, so you don't see no one attacking us. Uh, how's life in Raddy? What's life like in Ratai? We got sturdy walls and two castles to protect us. There's not many towns have that. And we got everything we need here. We got an apothecary, a swordsmith, an armorer, we got a beautiful church and fine alehouses. What happened to Radzig's sword? It's gone. I suppose we'll probably explore that a little bit more when we talk to Radzig. But presumably, uh, that guy got away with it, or he's dead. <laughs> you know, he's dead in in uh, Scarlet's with it somewhere over there. Somebody has it. How do the Ratai folk get on with the refugees? Don't even talk to me about it. I wish that rubble was gone. I know they've met with misfortune, but here they do nothing but thieve and make problems. Very well. God be with you. Well, he got real calm all of a sudden. God be with you. Boom, ba-doo, boo, ba-doo, 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 ba-doo. Yeah, let's go talk to Radzig. We'll probably mention 
with the sword. Man, I could really use a horse. Hmm? Hello. Can I marry any woman now? I discovered baths? Hygiene. Ooh. Wow. I can I can learn all about 1300 hygiene. Look at this. Oh my god. Scoop. Hey yo girl. A bathhouse? God be with you. What can I do for you? Uh what do you have to trade? Ar oh, I thought it said armor potion. A more love potion? You feel like Achilles and can withstand woozy wounds easily? Is that cocaine? Look at all these potions. A skill book on vitality. 54 bucks? How much do I have? 65? Oh. Lullaby potion. Makes user fall asleep in no time. Why? Why Why do they sell medieval NyQuil? Hey, yo, girl. Yo, can I holler at you just one time, though, real quick? Hey, yo. I'd like to uh, order something here. Uh-huh. And what do you want? I can shave... And get an air cut to have a bath and to launder my garments. To eel my wounds. Heal my wounds, bath and laundry, to pay for a winch and everything that goes with that. I'm not really looking to get I'm not really looking to get syphilis this early into the game though. Uh, I do need to launder my garments because they are actually dirty. Get myself fixed up a bit. Have a bath and get my clothes washed. But of course. Money first, though. How how much? Ten dollars! I'm not giving you that much. Yeah, let's haggle a smidge. And how much are you willing to pay? How about we go down to a cheeky seven and a half? I pushed E. It didn't work. What? I'd like to make use of the bathhouse's services. And what is it you'd like? Uh, what happened? Get myself... As you wish. Do I have the coin? Haggle. I'm not giving you that much. And how much... I try. I hit E to make an offer. <laughs> it was just too low. All right, eight. Is this enough? It'll take more than that to persuade me. Not bad. Eight and a half. Dude, I'm hitting E and it's it's not... It's backing out. <laughs> I'd like to, uh... So what? Come on, bruh. Proper bath. That can be arranged? I'm not giving you that. And how much... I'm, I'm making the offer. Uh, let's try it again. It doesn't... What? Is she... Is she, it, is she not accepting that? I'd like to... So... Proper bath. As you wish. It's I'm not, not saying my reputation's much. decreasing. And how much... Let's try it again, eight. What about this? You're a right pinch purse. All right, fine. You won't regret spending the money. I guarantee it. I guess. She just doesn't want to even talk to me with that low an offer. I don't know. Fine. Nine bucks. Oh, that was it. I don't get a, I don't get a cutscene for washing my clothes. Yeah, my helmet looks all nice and shiny now. They polished my, they polished my helmet. They also washed my clothes, too. Hey, son. Good day to you. Uh, how do you like the Cumans? Have you heard anything about the Cumans in Sigismund's army? Terrible things. Horrible. I have a Cuman uh, quote. I don't know which one it is, though. And what they do to the women folk. Better take your own life than fall into their hands. Beasts they are. Animals. That's fine. May the Lord watch over you. Nice. I'll part with nine bucks to get a smidge of, uh, of cleaning. I just, I want the full immersion. I want to see, I want to, I want a cutscene of that Cthulhu. On the level of 
Uh, you know, like the cats making the food in Monster Hunter World. You know what I'm saying? But of 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 the winches polishing my helmet instead. That's all. Is that so much to ask? I don't think it's that much to ask. So what do you, it's, it's, this is one of those games where, it's one of those games you don't want to wake up. Everything is fucked. Everybody sucks. No, not that. Hmm? Fast travel, nice. But fast, when you fast travel, it seems like you can uh, get encounters so you can fight people when you don't really want to and get into some sticky situations fast traveling. Uh, what do you think of this game, chat? I think some of you have played it, or at least watched it more than me, for sure. Uh, but what do you think? Should we, uh... Halt! Who are you, and where are you going? Continue Kingdom I'm Come Henry, after today? Son of the Scallet's blacksmith. I'm going to see my liege, Sir Radzig Kabila of Thvoyets. Of course you are, lad, and I'm the Pope. What do you want from his lordship, and what makes you think he'll see you? Uh... My, come on, my heart's in, my vitality's in eight. That's gotta be good. Come on, I'm not some peasant. I'm Sir Radzig's blacksmith, and I need to speak with him. It is my job to stop you. Now bugger off. Goddamn, son. I may not look the part, but I know about honor and duty. And mine is to tell Sir Radzik what happened to the sword he commissioned. All right, then go ahead. I should have speech It'll more. It'll be your skin if Sir Radzik isn't pleased. It's usually the one that works. I don't think he'll be that upset about the sword missing. This guy seems pretty chill. I, was, I need to level up. I have two, two points now. I'm also level four, so I can do the uh, level four stuff, right? Yeah, there's a couple level fours. Only a couple, though. Increases the time you can do without sleep. Your energy level falls one quarter more slowly. So, 25% more slowly? Penalties on stats following release from jail are 20% lower. You get penalties on stats? These sound pretty useful. This sounds really useful. The Insomniac one. Good evening, Captain Hazard. You're up late, sir. I'm going to get the Insomniac one. I am now an Insomniac. <laughs> yes. In towns and villages in their immediate vicinity, you have a plus one, a bonus on strength, agility, vitality, and speech. That sounds really good. But in the wilds, we have that plus one as well. Interesting. We've got to kind of shape ourselves. Jeez. We gotta shape ourselves. All right, sidekicks. I can't even click on the sidekicks one right now. Man, I am so low level <laughs> in so many things. Speech level five though. I actually feel like, I feel like, I don't know. What do you guys think is more important, lowborn or highborn? I feel like we talk to way more lowborn people. But I feel like if we had plus three speech talking to highborn people, uh, we'd probably get a lot more, right? In theory, you'd think that we, I mean, having that advantage to talk to, to the good folks, 100%. I agree. I think that is the way. Uh, yeah. For sure. Imagine talking to peasants. LOL. True. Highborn. That's us. Nice. Good call. We're about to go. I, I assume Radzig talks or it counts as a uh, highborn man, right? Oh, here's a camp. Like I can eat from a pot. I can sleep here. Nice. Do I need to eat? Ah, oh, we're good. I'm a, little, I'm a little sleepy, though. Hello? Good day to you. What do you need? You good? Did you find out what actually happened? Folks say it was an account of our silver and how Sir Radzig sides with the king. How does life in Ratai suit you? I suppose it was kind of them to take us in. But then they just left us to fend for ourselves. Nobody gives a damn about us. Goodbye. Goodbye. 
Goodbye. Scoop. I definitely need some running perks. I should probably increase my, uh, try to focus on learning how to increase my agility. That's a cool horse. Hello again. That be the Smith's son, Hal. On my soul. It is him. What are you doing here, lad? We thought you were done for. How's my helmet already looking dirty? Uh, I was attacked by bandits. Bandits attacked me in Scarlet's. And why, for God's sake, did you go back there? Who else but cutthroats and bandits did you expect to find? I needed to bury my parents. Oh, I see. Your father fought like a lion. I'm sorry. He saved my life. And not just yours. He was a good man, and you did right to bury him. Well, I didn't, didn't even manage that. Yeah, we failed. I failed to save him or put him to rest. And just what could you have done at Scalitz? If you tried to fight, the both of you would be dead. He gave his life for yours, Hal. So you'd better make good use of it. You're right. And just what are you doing here? I'm seeing the man. I'm going to speak with Sir Radzik. Is he here? He's in the palace with Sir Hanush of Ratai. They're feasting in the knight's hall. What do you want with him? My father made him a sword. He, um... He asked me to deliver it to Sir Radzik. I don't see any sword. No. Bandits attacked me and stole it. I need to tell his lordship what happened. And then I'm going to find the sword. Of course you are, Hal. Good luck. Thanks. Did it get dirtier? That's what I'm saying! It definitely got dirtier. But it looks clean in my, uh... My, my inventory here. Condition 86%? Hello? I'm looking for some frames. Hi. Excuse me. <laughs> what? Uh. Nice! Just straight up... Oh! Oh, God! You can fall in there. <laughs> Just straight up dropping it on the ground. <laughs> where the people might be walking. That's the way to do it, boys. Hello? Good day to you. Hello. Goodbye. The Lord watch over you. I don't think I can marry you. I need to learn how to read. God damn. My frames don't like being in here. Uh. They must be further upstairs, I guess. Maybe over Yom? They're peasants? I'm a man of the people. I will lead a Your bloody graces, revolution. I have to tell you in all seriousness that this land of ours is in the shit. Deep fucking shit. God, I was young then. Don't you agree? I might not have put it as eloquently as you, Hanush, but I've been driven out of my own castle, so I'm hardly going to disagree. Indeed. But Pirtstein is yours for as long as you need it. Room enough for your men and you here at Rate, and I'm sure my ward won't have any objection to me lending you his castle. I'd be honored. Perkstein is at your disposal as long as you wish, Your Grace. Just as well you have another castle at the other end of town, eh? <laughs> ah, at any rate, I'm beholden to you, Sir Hans, and to you, Sir Hanosh. Mm. I don't like to speak ill of your people, Sir Radzik, but, <laughs> well. There's no love lost between the townsfolk and the refugees. There's been talk of criminality. No, they'll have to get used to it until the situation's resolved. But when will it be resolved? And what on God's earth is this war even about? I won't lie, sir. I don't understand it. You aren't alone, Father. I believe Sigismund's original intention was to persuade Wenceslas to accept the imperial crown and to leave the rule of Bohemia to him. Who could blame him? I know Wenceslas is a friend of yours, Radzig, but even you have to admit he brought it upon himself. I can't deny the king neglected affairs of state for other pursuits. There is a need for order in the land, but I don't think the lords who sided with Sigismund realized just what Hungarian order looks like. <laughs> Hungarian order. <laughs> what concerns me, sir, is how a good Christian could resort to such brutality. 
To give him his due, I don't think he expected the lords of this country to stand behind the king. But thanks to him, we're tearing ourselves apart, and now he has to get things under control. But why in God's name does he have to use those barbarians? Money is the root of all evil, young sir. Wars are costly, and this one has dragged on for a year. Sigismund ran out of coin for knights, so he recruited those whore sons that settled in Hungary. The less he pays, the more they make up for it with plunder. That's why he attacked us. He was after our silver. What are you doing? Hi. You have no business here. Clear off. Wait, it's Henry. Hi, it's me. Henry, who disappeared after I clearly ordered him to remain at Taunberg. I'm sorry, sir, but I had to bury my parents. Had to? Do you think you were the only man who lost someone there? But the others listened to their lord. And it wasn't just your own life you nearly threw away. So Robard and his men risked theirs to save you. I'm sorry, but I had to. No, oh, there you go. When you have to, you have to, Radzik. Your father was a remarkable man, and your mother, she was remarkable too. They deserved a Christian burial. Did you manage that at least? No. I was attacked by thieves. I wouldn't be here now if it wasn't for that girl. Girl? The miller's daughter, Teresa. <laughs> the miller's daughter saved you from the footpads? We're not, we're not. There's a tale to tell <laughs> you, We're not getting children. much, many bradley points. She distracted them and then brought me to Ratai. But without Sir Robard, we'd both be dead. Oh, that's what I call a good woman. Hang on to that one, lad. Still, it's a great shame your parents are buried in unconsecrated ground. That means purgatory for them. Be quiet, friar. I didn't invite you here to eat me out of house and home and deliver a sermon while you were doing it. If you're so concerned, Father, maybe you should save the innocent souls of these fine Christians yourself. Go to Scalitz and consecrate their graves. I assure you, if you're killed by bandits, your soul will soar straight to heaven, as long as someone buries you in consecrated ground first. If there's anything left to bury, that plump carcass of yours would be quite a feast for the wolves and the crows. Crow! And one skeleton looks yeah. much like another, so how would we know which were your ordained bones or those of Sigismund's Tartars? Be that as it may, why have you come here? I must get your sword back. Sword? My sword hangs here at my side. No, the sword my father forged for you. One of those thieves stole it from me. They almost killed him and he already wants to go back. Takes after his father, I suppose. Lad. I've lost a castle, a village, silver mines, and a good half of my subjects. Why would I miss one sword? Because it's the last one my father forged, and I promised him I'd deliver it to you. I understand. I'd feel the same way. But prudence is the better part of valor, and a dead man keeps no promises. Aye. The woman had to save his fat from the fire, and now he wants revenge. What kind of fool are you, boy? He's no fool. Henry, you have courage. But you need training, arms, a horse. Or do you mean to beat this thief at dice? No, sir. Yes. Please, take me into your service and give me the chance to learn these things. The gall of him. Fled from the enemy, disobeyed your orders, duped Sir Divish, lost your sword, put Sir Robard in danger with his actions, and now he wants a promotion. Sir Capon's right. What you say is certainly true, except for fleeing the enemy. You would have run as well, believe me. Henry's earned some punishment, but how do you punish someone who's already lost everything, hmm? Courage and blind obedience are good qualities for a soldier, but a wise man also appreciates loyalty, perseverance, and determination. Besides, that was a fine sword that his father made. If he thinks he can get it back, I won't turn it down. My lord, he's a peasant. <laughs> you can't make a squire of a peasant. This guy. Why not? Someone made a priest of a pig. Oh! He isn't a peasant father, he's a blacksmith. And recent events have left me in need of his skills. So, you'd like to enter my service? So, I... Yes, I would. You won't regret it. <laughs> oh, I probably will. I'm doing this for your father, lad. Don't disappoint me. Well, fortune has finally smiled on you today, lad. Make the most of it. Now that I think about it, Sir Hanush, 
The boy needs training and experience, and you need spear carriers. Hmm. That's true. Bailiff is always complaining about your people making trouble in the camp. Maybe one of their own among the guard might help. It might. In any event, it will prove valuable experience. <laughs> but let's be clear. You're the one paying him. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Bernard, see to his training, and then send him to the bailiff. Yes, sir. And don't spare him. You can rely on it, sir. Don't forget, what? Henry. Don't disappoint me. I won't, my lord. My lord. Nice. Could have saved us now. Did. <laughs> Look at this man all highlighted. Hold up. Hi, Yaroslav. Good day to you. What do you need? Hello. And another. another thing. What? What? <laughs> what other thing? Have you met the local lord? Sir Hanush. Of course. He's a jovial sort and doesn't know what fear is. Thanks. Thanks. Bye. Good luck to you. <laughs> yeah, alright. The rats say tournament. Now we're going to start training to become even more powerful than we were moments ago. I, I'm digging it. I'm digging it, Chen. The ratty tournament. We're going to have to check out that ratty tournament, too. I can't tell if that's DLC or not. It told us a lot about it. I learned feudalism. <laughs> yes. Look at this big-headed fella right here. I learned about feudalism and toilets today. And also, I learned about books. <laughs> Life sure is mysterious, isn't it? Very good. But you know what else is mysterious? Uh, I'll tell you right now. What else do be mysterious? Biatch. Uh, I forgot. Bum, 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 bum. Box 94. Skirt. Hey. Also, my guy's getting tired. Wait, what's his energy? It's 50. It's 50, and he's already like swaying around. Anyway. Oh, you can just save and quit? You're allowed to save and quit. I di didn't say it used a, uh, a schnapp. That's kind of weird. Anyway. I have kingdom come today. Took us about four hours, but we beat the tutorial. So that's cool. I have 69 more achievements to unlock. So what do you guys say? Yay or nay? More kingdom come on Saturday? Should we continue Henry's epic adventure of becoming the greatest sneak thief the world's ever seen? Continually stealing from those that save him? The singular of schnapps is also schnapps, but I like the word schnapp. God damn it. More come kingdom delivery. I feel like it's getting good, dog. I feel like it's getting very good. So, that will just about do it for me tonight, ladies and gentlemen. I, You know, a round of applause. A very fun stream. I hope you enjoyed it as well. I know that I did. Very goodly stream. Very goodly. Thank you guys so much for the resubs today and the, the few pennies you threw at my face. And also, the follows. Appreciate y'all. Hope you enjoyed it. If you haven't already done so, I probably play more Kingdom Come Delivery. Deliverance. Saturday, which is today now. But for some people, tomorrow, Saturday, at 6.30 p.m. EDT, so very soon. Truly very soon. More Kingdom Come. I look forward to it. I look forward to improving. Uh, pretty unique game. I certainly feel powerless. <laughs> I, I gotta get used to the combat, because, man, it is weird. I know that I'm supposed to be bad at it, but geez louise. Let's see just how bad we can get. It's literally Saturday already. 
It's only been Saturday for 17 minutes, Chaos. You fool. Also, I see your sleep schedule has shifted yet again. Bum, 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 bum. A round of applause for you as well, Chad. Again, you guys have been great tonight. I appreciate you hanging out. Thank you so much. This has been Box94. I'm signing off. I'll see you guys very shortly at 6.30 p.m. EDT Saturday. Today. 18-ish hours. Yes. <laughs> but until then, stay smooth, stay square. And Echo, tell me a hungry joke. I don't have a joke about that. Okay. Echo, tell me a joke about vampires. Because vampires are from Hungary, right? What does a vampire use as payment? What's that? Cryptocurrency. Oh, my God. But it's literally just, it's just crypto. Because it's got crypt.